Oh, Guinea, the tears are much. Did you lose someone? Are you okay? This is your transport fare. Don't worry first, I will take care of that. Um, please, tell me your name. Maybe I will see you when I close work, huh? My name is... Chicken so Fuebu. My house is somewhere there. Um, please, whatever that is bothering you, put it away. Hold yourself, please. Life is not all about tears. It's not all about worries, Biko. Boss! I will think that, that guy they do theirself. I will see you later. Oh? Yeah, I'm not going to Oh, yeah? I know this. Nah, don't try this kind of thing. Wait till you Why the shot? He never be giving money to the shot. Why you go talk with the shot? Go down, you're telling me to take it out of here. Nobody can enter. Where are they costing you, my friend? In my church. You don't give me money. I've been roaming around the whole place. I've been homeless. When my father has a house, my mother is dead, and my brother is nowhere to be found. Uncle, I, I came here to tell you that my mother is, my mother's body is still lying in the mortuary. Uh -huh. So I should do what? Your mother is dead. You're out there in the streets. You're homeless. So how does that concern this family? How does that affect us? Now listen to me. Get out of this place. And I don't want to ever see you anywhere close to this compound again. Get out. Get out! Papa, stop that! Stop it! Is chicken or not your blood? Is she not part of this family? Huh? What kind of heart do you have? Are you talking to me, Chidi? Yes, Papa, yes! You're bracing up to me. Okay. Okay. Let us agree that her mother was evil and she was banished. Let me ask you this question. Is Chikam so evil too? She's evil. She's evil. She is evil, Chidi. Chidi, Mama do her. See down your lips for talking to your father like that. Eh? Hey, okay, okay. Why did you take this money? And as for you, Chikam so, nothing on earth will make you step your feet into this house. Hey, Nuria, yeah. Is it possible? My father has said it. What are you still doing here now? Go! My father has asked you to leave. Leave now! You said your mother is dead. Go out there and gather people. Take her to the evil forest and bury her there. That is where she belongs. If Oma, how can you say that to me? I am your sister, your blood. My mother was your mother. No! No! Your mother can never be her mother. Please, Ifoma. Please, 
help me and beg your father to understand. Understand what? Understand the fact that your mother wanted to kill my father. Kill me? Yes! Or understand the fact that you're shedding these crocodile tears while you have a very evil heart. Evil? Listen, listen to me, let me tell you. You cannot spend one moment in this house. Get out! If you shut up! If you shut, shut up! Don't you ask her to shut up! What? She has to talk. She has no right to talk. Don't shut her up. Hey. You don't think we'll come in this issue? Huh? If I hear your voice again, if I hear your voice you again, will do what? What I'll do to you? What will you do? 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 Cannot be part of this evil. Don't you people know that it's still the same cord that is binding all of us? Even that same Chikamso. Remind me of that, Chidi. Papa, what did Chikamso do to you? Everything bad. It was alleged that her mother was evil. Is evil. Let me correct that. Not was. Is evil. Evil. Okay. It was alleged that her mother is evil and she was banished. I want to ask you this question again. Is Chikamso evil too? And yes. I will answer you again. She is evil. 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 She is. And you have... She is evil. Let me warn you, Chik. I will kill you if I ever see you anywhere close to that girl again. And your father, I will kill you. As we speak, she could have weapons, dangerous weapons in those bags she's carrying. Yes. Chile, be, be careful. If you like, be careful. If you like, don't be. It's not my business. But listen, if she finally kills you, I will only cry you and make sure you are very delusive. And I will personally dig that. No, why head that six feet, that grave, I will personally dig that. She, she's evil. Papa, yeah, no, let me tell you people something. Chikamso might be evil. She might even, even be the devil herself. But I don't care. And I still want to ask you another question. Is Chikamso not part of this family? No, she's not. She's not. Uh, she she's not. It is now very obvious to me that you're senseless. Who are you asking such a useless question? Why are you talking to us? Hey, watch it. I want you not to talk. I am Muremba's daughter. Muremba, the, the one that was banished some years ago. Chika! Obele Chika! Hey! Chika, mom! How are you? Hey, give me a tea. Wipe your tears, Bedebe. How, how is your mother? Mm. 
my mother is dead. Hey! Hey! I don't know more. He is lying in hell. Her body is in the mortuary as we speak. There is no one to help us. No one. Since we left the village, my mother was in pains. She was in so much pains until, until she died. I now use the small money I had on me to deposit her body in the mortuary at Ufuma. That's where we have been since we left the village. I... Oh, yo. Mom, Biko, Biko, have you gone to tell him why? Have you gone to advise him? I went there. Oh, oh, oh say, he didn't even allow me to enter the house. His wife and his daughter pushed me out of the compound. Even when I told them what had happened. Oh, Mom, Biko, Biko, a person, a person. Oh, please. You're a daughter of this land. Eh? And they must at least listen to you. A person I'm going to go inside. Go inside and rest. I will go and see Moya and some of the king's men. Oh them. Don't worry. Just go inside. Oh. Thank Bye. you. Hi. I'm going there right away. Thank you. There's food. There's food under the, the, the cupboard. We go. That's hi. All is well. So you took your time to come all the way from your house to see me. Uh, it's okay. Mm. It's alright. Mm. Okay. No. Mm. Okay. Mm. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> Old age okay. is a. Uh, is a sickness. <laughs> but that's what we're all praying for. So, what brings you to my house? I hope all is well. All is not well. How can all be well when your father's wife's body is there in the fridge and her daughter has been chased away from her father's house? Is that what you left your house all the way to this place to tell me? Yes. That girl is your blood. You should not have chased her away from her father's house. She only came here to tell you about her mother's death. Her mother is your father's wife. You were the one that begged the Ummunna to go and convince your father to take a younger wife that would look after him during his old age. Wasi Kanasi. When you were in the city, near Toy Colombia, I was one of the few that convinced your father to marry Rema. Hmm. Nah, please, do what she asks for of you. Hmm. Well, well, are you not aware of what she did? How she buried charms all over the compound? Until I discovered those charms and they were dug up. And then she was, as a result, she was banished as a result of that. I, are you not aware of that? I am aware of that. So? Yes, I am aware of that. 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 So? But the children were not banished. With they were all banished. No, they were not. They were all banished. They were not. All of them were banished together. Bia, she only took her children along because she was a good mother. 
Those children were too young. She took them along so she could take care of them. All I am asking you is to go and beg the Omona to go and bring back that body so it will be buried within the community. Hmm. Would you respect if you were not a member of this family, I would have pushed you out of this compound. Yeah? So come here to tell me this. And please don't come back here again to tell me this. Don't. That woman was banished and so, so are her children. If for any reason you, you, you are accommodating that girl in your house, you also stand the risk of being, of, being, of being banished. That's what the law says. Hey! Let me tell you something. That girl will not leave my house until you people bring back the mother's body to be buried. Hey, Moye. As the head of this family, you should show peace by coordinating everybody. Not destroying your home. Eh? Oh, yeah. Since that girl stepped into my house this morning, she has been crying her soul out. Have you forgotten how it feels to lose a mother? When you lost your own mother, I remember how you cried. You be color, but, but you were crying like a child. Energy is ages and I. Do what you're supposed to do, Moye. Call Omona and bring back the body. Don't, don't, don't come back here again to tell me this. And don't forget, this compound belongs to me young did you ever curse nor beat your mother god forbid no and if anybody had done that i would have gone to war against that person you know as the mother hen protects its chick so does a woman protect her children i know of course yes uh, but you have been talking in parables uh, what is the matter tell me <laughs> hey no Uremma is dead. What? As we speak, her body is in the fridge at Ufuma. Hey! Her daughter came back to inform Moye of what has befallen them. Imakwada Moye and the wife chased her out of the house. Moye, Moye. Hey! Uremma! Uremma was a good person. Before she was banished, 
She always made sure that I ate. All the marble and my farms were harvested. My cassava, my yams, everything she harvested for me. You, you remember? The day she was banished, I was not even around. Of course, I remember. Yes. And then the people all I'm asking is for you to talk to Moye. Let them bring her body back. Let it be Where is the daughter of Uremma uh, now? She's in my heart. Hi. On Ankem. Yeah. I'm going to talk to Moye. Biko. And I'm coming to see you right away. Biko, I don't want to Rema's body to be thrown away. Oh. Nobody will throw Rema's body away. Oh. Who Rema must be buried in this community. Oh. Eh? Oh, oh, nah. From the day my mother was banished till the day she died, she never got herself. She was so sick. But she swore to me. She swore to me with the name of God and the name of all the deities of this land that she had never, never been to a Dibia's house or any shrine. Yet, an innocent woman was accused of something she did not do. How, how bad can a human heart be? How bad? Now, I have lost my mother. A woman who swore to me that she did not do what she was accused of. <sighs> On her deathbed, she asked me to swear on her behalf. She asked me to swear on her behalf. And that is why I am here, so that I can swear and then they bring her corpse back and bury her in her husband's house. That my is all. My daughter. Stop crying. I am here to know the next thing to do. It was true that she was banished. And... Um, you know that when someone is banished from a community, he or she is not allowed to return to that community anyhow, whether dead or alive. Echi, was I banished too? Oh, no, no, no. You were not banished. You were not banished. Uh -huh. But Moye was saying that she was banished. I see, I see. I see. Moye lied. Moye, is a siaru. The woman was banished because of something they alleged against her. But not against her children. Anyway, um, my daughter, I want to advise you to be calm. I know it is not a good experience for someone to lose a mother, but I want to advise you to be calm. I'm going to go and meet with the other Omunas, and we are going to talk about this. May God bless you. Thank you. God you. Stop crying, oh. Everything will be fine. He who throws a pan full of ash receives it back. Exactly. When they planned banishing this woman, I told them my hands are not there. I brought a boil of water and washed my hand. 
like Pilate did. Were you not there? Of course, I was there. I was there, my brother. Now, tell me, why must Woye lay all his frustrations on this woman, Urema? He was the man who married this Urema to his father. And when the father died, this woman was there taking care of the family land and all that. I don't know why some people should be very wicked. Moye has a son and daughter. And so has Urema. Now tell me, what is he dragging with this poor woman? I don't know. But all I know is that we are going to help this lady bring back the body of her late mother and make sure that she's buried here. BAM! That is it. No, 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 no. Punishment or not? Yes. She's our wife. Of and course. she must be buried here. Of course. Of course. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, my God. Oh, yeah, my God. Hold on. Hold on. Please, I'm looking for someone. She's from this village. Okay. She gave me a direction to the house, but um, I've searched and searched. I'm confused. Who is she? Her name is Chikamso. Chikamso? Yes. Is Chikamso in this village? I don't know. Are you sure of what you're talking about? I am very sure. I met her a few days ago and she directed me to this side. Well, if you're sure of what you're talking about, I will direct you to his uncle's house. That's okay. Moye. Yeah, yeah. That, Moye. Yes, that's If one. you go straight, okay. you go like this, you will see one house like that. Okay. You enter there. Okay. If you're sure. If I walk straight down. Yes. Take my right turn. Yes. Okay. A black gate. Okay. Just enter there. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Chikam so by name. Who? And who told you Chikam so this year? Huh? Who told you Chikam so lives here? Oga, okay, please. Don't be offended. I only asked you a question. I didn't shout at you, sir. Now, young man, listen up. This is my house. Chikam so, or whatever you call her, does not live here. And don't you ever come back here again asking after that name again. Now get out. Get out of my house right now. Oh God, please. With due respect. Calm down. Calm down now. Stop shouting at me. I didn't shout at you. I only asked you a question. Uh -uh. If you have anything that is eating you up, you keep it to yourself. Are you, are you talking uh -huh. to me like that? Oh, you are talking uh, to me like that for what now? You are, what you, are what you are very, very stupid to have spoken to my father like that. You obviously don't have manners. You walk into someone's compound and you run your mouth anyhow. See, don't you ever talk to my father like that anymore. Else, why get what they mean up on a vipa? Why are you not getting it? Get out! 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 Hey! 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 I came into this compound, greeted this man. Eh? The next thing they started using abusive words on me. But he could have killed you there. But God punish you there for referring to, referring, referring to that as this man. God punish you there. Get out of my house, idiot. I'm here. Let me handle this. Please. Um, who do you say you're looking for? Lord, I'm looking for Chikamso. Chikamso. Papa, did this guy insult you or... That he just asked of Chikamso. What kind of question is that? Get out! Answer me! What kind of question is that, Chidi? Is this Chikamso's house? Does Chikamso live here? Allow me, please! Hey! I didn't ask Hey! Hey! Get out of my house! You are still here! I'm coming. I am very, very sorry about all this. Okay? You won't understand. Alright? 
But let me direct you how to get chicken too. I'll be Look at this river. It's okay, it's okay. It's okay. Next time, just It's okay. You want to get it? What is that? Mama, it was horrible. You needed to see the way Chidi was shouting at Papa and I in front of the guys that came here looking for Chikamsu. Tomorrow the boy will go out and be spreading that we are bad. That we are not good people. Can you imagine? You see it. You see it. Your son Chidi is taking too much in this house. Yet, you won't do anything about it. Can't you handle him as a father? Eh? The boy that came looking for Chikamsu, who knows who he is? Eh? If I go out there, start saying all sorts of rubbish because of us, all because of Chidi. Ch uh, Ch uh -huh. What am I? What did you say to the boy that came here looking for that evil girl? Please leave my shirt. If I don't, do you hear me? I won't do anything. But please leave my shirt. Papa, Papa, you're not saying anything. Please, tell Mama to leave my shirt, please. Let's hear what? If Mama refuses to, to leave your shirt, what will you do? If Oma... Imagine. What will you do? If... Imagine. If Oma, okay. I'm warning you. Huh? I will slap you. If you try it, Chedi. If you try it, Mwara Kekbe, Uchegiru. Zuzu Bwebo, sister. I don't know if you You will go out and be doing good boy, good boy. When you come back here, you just be doing anyhow. Okay, Maniro. Come back, doctor. Hey. Please, my name is Iken. <laughs> Not conductor. But if I am working. I am a conductor. If I am not, I am a king. <laughs> Who showed you this place? Uh, well, um, I went to a place I was directed. And the man I met almost attacked me just because I mentioned your name. It was the son who came out and calmed the whole situation. 
he was the person that showed me the direction to this place. And he said his name is um, Chidi. Oh, Chidi. Yeah. <laughs> Chidi is my brother. And that man is my elder brother. Just that sometimes life has a way of swinging back and forth, but it's okay. Don't worry about it. It's okay. I understand, my dear. So, who is the old woman that welcomes me very well? <laughs> That's Granny. She's my father's sister. <laughs> How are you today? Um, the day we met, you cried from the park to this village. I was watching you. I hope that thing that made you cry is soft. It's not solved yet. But it's not for you. It has to do with my wicked elder brother and some of our kinsmen. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Um, Chikamso, I am now a friend. I went to school. Forget the fact that you saw me the other day doing a conductor work just to survive. <coughs> I can bring in good suggestions on what to do and what not to do. Please, share with me. I'll tell you, but not today. Um, I'm just coming back from the stream and I'm very hungry. I'm very sure Mama will be hungry too, so... But... You're supposed to be at work. Aren't you going to work today? Um, yes. The boss has a leakage from their source. And the Panabita is working on it. When he is done, we will go to work. Um, let me start going before the driver will start looking for me. Okay. You can't do this now. You can't. I have a lot of problems on my head now. So I am not ready for a relationship. I don't want a boyfriend. I don't even, just don't give me money. I'm okay. I don't want your money, please. Chick, I'm so. I am not giving you this money because of what you said. No, no. I am not. I am giving you this money because of the tears I saw in your eyes the other day. I am giving you this money again because the young girl I met the other day was seriously in pain. Please, just have it is from my heart. I beg you. Please. Please. Thank you. But as a conductor, how come? I mean, the money is much. Um, don't worry, it's not your issue. I'll see you some other time, please. Okay? Let me run out.
body of our wife Urema in another person's land. Neither will she be buried in another man's land. Let us think like men. The daughter has done a good job by depositing the body in the mortuary and running back here courageously to come and tell us. Let us bury the past. We are beginning to call a mocky hand a human hand. We all know that Urema was banished from this community with her children by the late Igwe. The Igwe did not banish the children. Too. That is true. And then, the entire community is aware. Was she banished for nothing? No. She was evil. I personally saw some of the charms that she buried in this compound. So how can you people say her dead body be brought back to this village? It is a taboo that all of us here must not be part of. <laughs> Let her bury her dead mother where she died. And that is my position. Um, let me remind us that whatever one sows, that the person shall reap. Oh, hey, hey. We all live in this community with Urema. She was a good person. She was so good to all of us. She never quarreled with anybody. How come she suddenly began to bury charms in the compound? When uh, Moye came back from, uh, from the city, how suddenly she began to plan on how to kill Moye? I said all this even before she was banished. But nobody listened. Brother, you people, some idiots, some of the bad elements, Ganged up and banished that woman from this community. Obelo Kute, Obelo Kute, name where you keep no, no. Eh, the children get shut up. Moa, shut up. Moa, shut up if you don't have anything to say. We know why you are saying this. We know that Orema is good. Orema was good. Orema was his. Because he don't have a jia. He don't have a boy. You were sleeping with my father's wife. We all are aware. But we purposely kept quiet. Now, you're soliciting for her to be brought back here, to be buried. So you can continue to Baba. You can continue sleeping with her dead body. But Amadio I will strike you dead if you say that. Okay. Oh, okay. 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 You just swear. She will not have done this case. The case where we sit between you and I over this. Oh, good day. Is it okay? Me? We all are brothers. This problem is a huge one. It has been nine years we sent this woman out of this land. We never care how she has been managed to with her children. Although we call it banishment. Our Iwe who gave order to send her out is dead. My brothers, let us look deep into this problem. And they resolved it once and for all. Eloze, Eloze, there's nothing to be resolved here. Yeah. Why? What do you mean by that? Absolutely nothing to be resolved. Yeah, Why? Why? It will not happen while I'm alive. You are a fool. You will you shut up. You hear me? Why? You are a fool. 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 You are a and the tradition of our people, when somebody is banished, that person has no other relationship with his or her people. So, why are we discussing on something that is not important? We all saw that charm that was alleged to be buried by Urema. I am not saying that the woman was a saint. No. After a whole nine years, and finally she died, the daughter is pleading that her mother will be buried in this village. Is that wrong? And I am telling you that the gods will strike us dead 
if we do that. Let her be buried elsewhere. Or better stay, let her daughter call her mother's people to take the cars. That little girl is even crazy to step, step her feet here to tell us nonsense. That woman was sent on an exile and she died there. And that's it. Look, Elonze, we must not see the coffin or the casket. It will be a taboo. Let me ask you, were the children punished too? Not at all. So, why did Moe stop her from entering his house? Moe owns the house. His father, Isaac, does not have a house. He lived in his son's house till he died. So, Moe has the right to say no. Especially the event that led to the banishment. He's even afraid that he will be poisoned. Okay. Isaac built a house. Moye demolished it and built another one. So, don't tell me that Isaac didn't have a house. Isaac built a mud house of those days. Only his son, the hell of the family, builds his own house on his land. In as much as I pity the children of the late woman, I would advise you to tell the daughter to throw away her mother's cause. Or better stay, she should pray that she never have an evil mother like Orema in her next world. No. No. She cannot throw her out. No. I think I am done with this. Thank you. Moy is just being stupid and foolish. Yeah? We can't sit and watch him continue like that. Look, if we continue to beat about this issue, your mother's body will turn into a rotten heap in that mortuary. From what they are saying, it is going to be very, very hard for us to bury your mother here. Uh, some of our kinsmen have soiled their hands with evil. When they see white, they call it black. When they see black, they call it red. I understand exactly what Anene is saying. Um, mortuary bill is high. Let us look around for a good cemetery and bury her there. Hi. Mbanono. Mbanono. Tiche nyerono no maka no. Nyerono no maka. You people should help me. Help me. My mother was a good woman, oh. She was a good woman. She married my father because from her childhood, she suffered a lot. She lost her parents at a very tender age. Even as we speak now, her only brother was buried Three years ago. So, who do you want me to run to? Oye kunu chon kampesalo. Oye kunu chon kampesalo. Eh? Hi. Being a mother is not an easy task at all. It is not. That woman suffered. She suffered for us. Even in death, they don't want her to have peace. They want her to continue suffering. Oh, they don't matter. We are only trying to find a solution to this. Huh? 
She can run. Hi. The fact that you can fight for your mother to be brought home to be buried is a good thing. And, and I will support you on that. If I had a daughter like her that would fight for me as a daughter, I would not be in this condition. So mama boleba ralu. Because Nene can not be one look into her heart and help her. It is her mother that we are fighting for. It is her mother that she's fighting for. I understand her fight. And I understand her tears. On your sukwabulia. On your sukwanabulia. Bikonu. Ndiche. Nyalukana no maka help her. Let her mother be buried in this community. Bikonu. Okwanesiwa madakane kwokwefa. We are trying to do our best. My mother was married properly. She was married properly. Maybe her only offense was that she married an old man because of the condition and the position of her family. She was accused of being evil. And she was banished. She was sent out from this village. You are aware how old my brother and I were when this thing happened. Nobody cared. Nobody cared. But my mother took it upon herself to make sure that my brother and I survived. She suffered. Now she is dead. Over my dead body will now allow her corpse to be buried elsewhere, if not in this village and in her husband's house. Chica, be cozy, huh? Let me swear. I am ready to swear. I will swear with all the deities in this village. I will swear on my father's grave. Bring the Bible. Bring chaplets. If I bring the blessed sacrament, I will swear because I know that my mother was accused unjustly. I know that my mother was innocent of all the charges. She was accused and banished for something she did not do. And she died for something she did not do. At least you people should bury her. Let her rest. Why are one half of four? Let her rest. She has suffered. Una kwa aluki enando. Una na kwa aluko zie na mu. Odi ne kumano. Oya se kwa bulia. Kama ni azuzi ni kena taka fufu. Let her rest. Oya ojo. Kama ni azuzi ni kenu. Eh ni azuzi ni kenu. Keni hobo. We will do the best that we can. Hey, busy now. Hey, busy now. Hey, mama mo. Let them allow the girl to bury her mother. We are all aware that the woman is dead. At least she is fighting for her mother. No. This matter has come to the point where urgent decisions must be taken. How? Ha. Chikamso has sworn that she will hang herself if the mother is not buried in this land. Papa, you know Chikamso and myself used to be friends. So they said nobody should talk to them. I wonder how big she is now. That girl is always shedding tears. Mm -hmm. She's always crying. Nai, what do you expect? She and her mother have been subjected to mockery over the years. 
And that is basically why she doesn't want her mother to be buried elsewhere. Mama, please. Do not support this thing they want to do. They should allow Chikamso's mother to be buried in this village. All these elders, they will not just say the truth. Is Naimwe not wicked? Naimwe is not a good man. He and Chikamso are from the same father. Yet he treats Chikamso with so much cruelty. Well, we are still talking about the thing. We will still talk about it. We will deliberate on it until we find solution to it. to beg you to help me. Brother, please help me. I know that a lot of things happened in the past between my mother and yourself. But, brother, in this whole world, I am the only sister that you have. Yes, you have a daughter. But when it comes to sister, sister, uncle, Ifo, I am the only one that you have. So please help me. Forgive my mother because I know that once you forgive her, all these things will end. Hey, 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 it's okay. What did I tell you the last time you came here? Have I not warned you? You should come here again. And that your mother, your late evil, devilish mother, she would only be buried in this village when I'm dead. Now out. Get out! What is this? My, my dear. Were you not here the last time this evil girl came to this place? Mm -hmm. What did I tell her? Did I not tell this evil child that I do not want to see her ever again here? Yes. Here she is. Back here again, this time calling me her brother. Do we look alike? What are you? Huh? Am I your brother? You see that your evil dead mother, her cops will be thrown into the evil forest. That's where she belongs. If that is your wish, it will never happen. It will not happen. My mother will be brought back to this village and she will be buried in this compound. This Chikamso. is her compound. Chikamso, are you challenging me? I ask you, Chikamso, are you challenging me? All right. Let us see how you and your evil cohorts will bring the cops of your Dead evil mother back to this village to be buried. Let's see how it works out. Chikamso, you don't have respect anymore. Look at the way you're talking to my father. You have lost your manners, okay? Mba, get out of this compound. We don't need you now. Go! You this evil girl, go! We don't need you. Go! He is your father. But he is my brother. And the same right you have in this compound, that is also the same right I have. Mind the way you talk to me. I am your elder. Mind the way you talk to me. What, what did you say? What did I... ah! oh, you very stupid. Yes. You're very, very stupid. Are you mad? How do you talk to me like that? Oh, get out of there. Get out. Are you mad? 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 Hey, it's gonna go back and close that gate. Go back and close it. Lock it. Look at this evil child. She has fought my day. Rubbish. She has fought my day. Don't worry, let's go inside. Don't worry. Don't worry, I'll take care of you. If I'm a piece of this, we don't want to tell her about it. If I'm a gassi, okay? Oh my god.
Non, qui nous croit 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 If you keep crying, <laughs> yeah? you keep crying every now and then. I've told you to relax. God will decide. <laughs> now, if you fall sick while crying, we'll be going to the mortuary to, to look at to look after my mask ups. Yeah? Just relax. It's okay. I went to the house. To beg your father to help me with this issue. <laughs> the next thing, if a man and your mother came out and started talking, <laughs> look at my jig. If a man slapped me, she even pushed me out of the house. <laughs> so. If Oma slapped you and you did nothing, are you not ashamed of yourself? You even you even getting me angry. How? If Oma slapped you, you didn't beat her up. You didn't look for something to break her head with. She comes so you are my blood. You are my sister. That family is also your family. That compound also belongs to you. My concern is not about bearing charms here and there. My concern is about you, your brother, your late mother. All of us belong to this same family. But Chidi, honestly, I do not understand the former at all. I mean, is it that she doesn't have a heart or what? Eh? Both of us are the only women in that family and she has failed to understand that. something okay you must not depend on me alone all right okay thank you thank you very much it's all right it's all right you know i am no more that small boy you used to know <laughs> smile for me now <laughs> better you know now i'm a big boy and i'm part of that woman now so all of us will decide what will happen there. Huh? So let's just wait. Okay. Uh -huh. What of the mortuary bills? Who is taking care of it? I paid for three months. And it will expire by the end of this month. So 
okay. It's okay. You have tried. Thank you very, very much. Thank you. But please, if there's anything, anything, just let me know. We'll handle it together. Okay? Um, right now, I, I want to watch you go. Okay? And I'm just coming from the van. Let me rush home. Okay? Okay, just go. Thank you. It's all right. Thank you very much. It's okay. My God. Eh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Come back, come back, come back. Wipe these tears. I don't want to need to say it. Please, do it here. alone especially you leave that girl alone god is watching all of you eh? how can you be chasing your own flesh and blood out oh god Chica, i can see your uncle you've grown beards that you now brace up to your father get as far as warning me but listen let me tell you Better be careful, else I will disown you. Your mates are all out there, living in their own houses. And you are under my roof, eating my food. And you still have the guts to talk when I'm talking. God punish you. Papa, in case you don't know, some of my mates are still living in their father's property. Some fathers went to the city, made money there, gave it to their children. So that they will survive. Some of them went to went to Obodo Ibo, gave birth to their children there. Those kids are citizens of that country. Eh? If you are sure that you are a father, if you are really a father, prove it to me. Give me money. Let me start up a business. Instead of you, here you're you're here chasing chasing your own flesh and blood out. Chewenu, wait for me to give you money, child, child. Here you go. Do you know you make a lot of sense when you keep quiet? When you don't talk? Chidi, because whenever you talk, in a query, a query, Jesus. Can you hear yourself talk? Obodo Ibasipa, Obodo Ibasiro. Are you not a man? Have you not grown into a man to take care of yourself and stop eating Mama Tankman? Go around the village, you will see houses, houses, beautiful houses all over the place. On Maduroria, on Dobogi. And whatever I say, Papa sets me up. He's telling me, Anyway, I don't blame you. I blame Papa because he has been the one tolerating all your rubbish in this house. If your man who asks for opinion in this issue now, who are you for me not to talk? You are an idiot. If from if you don't close up, I will slap you. Hey, she If you think that you're a man, don't you, Farmer? Oh. Slap her, can't forget. And I slap. Mama. Mama, do you know that you are the one encouraging this idiot? Eh? Mm. You are the one encouraging this 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 sequence. You are the stupid idiot. You are very useless. You are hopeless. Eh? Oh, I am hopeless.
But I show you, I will put an end to it. Yeah. I don't understand. Eh? You don't understand. You don't understand the fact that you are a witch. Yes. Or you don't understand that you are evil. Just like your useless, stupid, nonsense, dead mother. Mm -mm. Please. My mother is dead. Oh. Don't involve her in this issue. Mm. I, I am not evil. You know I am not evil. Mm -hmm. Why are you people doing this to me? Yeah. Why? They're not evil. Let's find out. In a change. Organic. Please. Allow this evil she devil to stay banished. Let her leave your house! Or you will die like your dead mother. No, 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 You don't talk about a dead woman as if she's part of the issue. Chika is in my house. You have no right to come here and ask me to send her away. Now take this, your, 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 your stupid daughter, and give my compound. Hey! Old witch! If I refuse to leave your dirty house, what will you do? What will you do? Eh? What will you do? Did you just call Unne a witch? You heard me. Yes. No. Don't insult Unne. That is the one I will not take from you. Don't insult Unne at all, no. Hey! You a smelly pig. Talk to me again and let me feed you with this sound that you speak of. Try it. It's yours. Try it again. Did you see that? Nonsense. Ifo. Uncle You mean if former and the mother did this to you? Eh? Ada. Can you do this to your sister? Ada. Can you do this to your blood? Just look at what Ifoma did to me. Look at what Ifoma did to her sister. And Ifoma can be me one year. Don't look at. Eh? I know how I suffered to get the clothes that I have right from when my mother was sick till she died. Now look at Ifoma. For my my clothes. Eh? Who's the is in now? What what is wrong with Ifoma? What is wrong with her? How can she forget that both of you are sisters? How can she forget that your mother's corpse is still in the mortuary? Hmm? She was insulting me. Just because Nne asked her and her mother to leave me alone. What did I do to them? What? I, in my next life, if there is anything like reincarnation, if it exists, I will never come from a family. A family that hates each other. I will never come from a family that does not value brotherhood. Never. Chee. Chee, you know you're like my childhood friend. And your mother was like my mother. I want to advise you to hold on to yourself. Hmm? Stop crying. And don't fight. The only fight you have to fight now is the fight of your mother. 
Just be strong. And I promise you, with time, everything will be okay. Hmm? Be busy now. Thank you. Thank you so much. But please. Not for myself. Not for them. That woman has suffered. If only they can bring her corpse back to this village and bury her. At least let her rest. Why are they going to have to go to the village? Madam, you will be a mother one day. And I will be a mother too. Someday. Our children will not abandon us the same way I will never abandon my mother. So please help me. Chebezina no, eh? Chokan bebe kwankem. Chokan bebe kem. Bye bye. Bye bye bye. Can you? Yeah. What happened to you? Nothing. What do you mean nothing? Look at bruises all over your face and you're telling me nothing. Did you fight with anybody or somebody beat you up? It's nothing, Ikenna, it's nothing. Okay. Meanwhile, you didn't go to work today. Mm. Why? Um, our boss went for a charter. So a guard driver asked me to rest today. Um, what of Mama? Oh, Mama went to see somebody. Okay. Ne, since you don't want to tell me what happened to you, can you at least tell me why you were crying the other day we met? Please. It's about my life. It's about my world. I don't know if I have any more tears left in my system. This, this life has really dealt with me. Um, ne, please, if you are going to waste more tears, that means I have to go. I don't like seeing tears. Please. Can't you talk to me without pouring more tears? Please. You... You asked me the other day. And I said I will. But how can I tell you without pouring tears? How? <gasps> My story is painful. And painful stories come with hot tears. Sit down. Keep me one minute. I'll be back.
I was born into the family of a man called Isaac. Though people preferred to call him Isaac. My father was an old man by the time I got to know him. It was said that my father married his first wife and for 10 years they did not have any child. He later married his second wife when the first one died. is the mother of that my brother that you saw that day you came to the village. Moye became an only child. Years later, his mother died too. When he became of age and wanted to go to the city, he decided to marry a woman for his father so that his father would not be alone. His father refused and he called his kinsmen who persuaded him to at least get somebody that would take care of him and cook for him. That was how my mother came. That means it was one man that gave birth to you and to this father. And I also have a younger brother. I was 14 years old when my father died. That was when everything started. I am the one that married you. I am the one that paid your bride price. My father is late now. And as the first son, everything that belongs to my father will now belong to me, including you. It's a lie. I cannot sleep with father and son over my dead body. Who are you? Your late father was my husband. How can you think of sleeping with you now that he is late? Aaron! Tfia! Whoever listen to me. Listen to me. I have spoken to you like a gentleman. I have begged you. Are you going to be a A Jew. It appears you want us to fight. You want us to quarrel over this, over, over this issue. If that's what you want, I will give it to you. Who are you? You have a wife and children. If you want anything, go to your wife. She will give it to you happily. My, my last son was his 10 years. Ah, how can I sleep with you? It is your own that I want. It's impossible. Okay, okay, okay. I want your own. I'm, uh, well, okay, okay, okay. I want your own. Okay. <clears throat>
since that day, life became so unbearable for my mother, myself, and my brother. There was a day my brother came back from the city and saw my mother seated with one of the king's men. And... my house into a brothel. Now, I did not build this house for men like you in this community. Huh? I did not. Urema, if you want to go into prostitution, please, I beg of you, go and rent a house somewhere and do that. Not here. Moye, what are you saying? You heard me loud and clear. Okute, or whatever you call yourself. Since my father died, you and idiots like you have turned my house into a, 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 into a brutal. What are you doing with the widow? Oh, you do not talk to me in that manner. Did you hear me? And mind what you say before these children. She has not turned your house to anything. Remember, the woman you are talking about is your late father's wife. Oh, how much respect. Really? I all have that respect. Is yes. Huh? All right. But we shall see. We shall see. We shall see nothing. We shall see. We shall see what? Oh, yeah. We shall see what? You have been harassing me in this compound. You've been calling me names and I've been respecting you. Mind yourself, won't you? You have a wife at home. How would you feel if some people or somebody comes out and starts insulting your wife the way you are insulting me? Oh, ask him. How will you feel? How will you take it, won't you? Urema, you dare warn me in my house. You dare warn me in my house. I am not warning you in your house. But this is my house also. Oh, really? This is my husband's yeah. house. Yeah. Yes. You, you, okay. I warn you. I said, hold yourself. Would you take your filthy hands off me? Take your filthy hands off me. Oh, yeah. Are you out of your mind to hold me? Huh? Oh, yeah. You're talking to me now. now. get out of this house. I am not getting out. Get out of this house right now. I am not going anywhere. Oh, Kute, I ask you to get out I of this I am not getting out. Get out of my house now! And if I decide not to get out, and what I, would you... And I say again, don't tell me. Okay, no problem. I will leave. Moye! I am leaving your house. Look at me, I'm leaving your house. Huh? We shall see. We shall see, Moye, we shall see. Every time, wah, 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 wah. Moye, nene, no. Moye, nana. We shall see. Nonsense. I love you. Oh, Urema. No. So this is it. You've 
turned my house into a brothel where you bring in men to sleep with. Isn't it? Uncle, please, is enough. Will you shut up? Just shut up. How am I sure you're not part of this whole thing? How am I sure she's not even, she's not started bringing men to you? <laughs> Uncle, Uncle, please forgive us. We are all the same family. Whatever my mother must have done to you. Please forgive because of me and your book. We have been finding it difficult to stop giving up something because. Oh, because. What did you call me? What did I hear you call me? Uncle. You called me, Uncle. Am I your uncle? Do we look alike? Do we in any way look alike? Problem started when Moye retired and came back to the village fully with his family. He said unprintable things about my mother to them and they ganged up against her and started planning on how to throw her away from the house. One day, they found charms buried in the compound. Hi! Want to kill me? Have you seen the other orders at the back? Orders at the back. Hey. Bearing champs all over the country, in front and at the back, to kill me and my entire family because I asked her to stop bringing in men here to sleep with. That's all. That's my offense. Evil woman! Evil woman! You want to kill me and my family? Only again, you will never walk. Yeah. You will never walk. Ah, I don't know. You know what i Look at it. There are still others at the back. Who ran my belly champs all over the compound? Had to stop bringing in men here to sleep. Urema, so you want to kill Moye in his own house? It's all lies. <laughs> but you are looking shut up. What's up? I did not know anything about all this. He's lying against me. <laughs> Moye. Yes. How did you discover that these charms were buried here? Thank you very much for that, for that question. Eh? I was coming back from the farm the other day. And as I was walking, walking, I'm walking. I noticed something, something strange on the ground. I almost stepped on it. 
I looked carefully. It was something very strange. Very, very strange. He looked like a child. So I became scared and ran to Dimba. Went to Dimba. Told Dimba what I saw. And Dimba, after consultation, told me they were charms. And they were buried all over my compound. Hello. And I told him to please come. And he came with me and dug them all up. There are even some at the backyard. Some on top of the roof. She buried them all over the place. Hey, Urema. Urema, that's all I did for you. Hey. The gods are not happy with Urema. How can she plan this evil to her own family? She buried the charms. And if care is not taken, Moye and his family are living in great risk. Urema, the Dibe has spoken. So you are evil. You have such a wicked heart. Hmm. Moye, hmm? I will advise you to inform the Igwe and the entire community. Igwe. We do not allow such a woman in this Igwe. community. My elders. <laughs> I'm not responsible for all this. They are lying against me. That, will you shut up your mouth? How dare you accuse the, the, the mouthpiece of, of the gods of telling lies against you? Are you out of your senses? Look at her. Evil woman. He knows they move out from there. This thing might affect you. And then they will not come out. Come out of that place. Hey! Grandma! God of the wizards! <laughs> Look at you, you crying. What are you crying for? Crying more than the bereaved Oyoshi! Oyoshi! A witch! Die! They said that the offense cannot be forgiven. <laughs> and that the only way out is banishment. That was how my mother and her two innocent children were banished from this village. My mother never got herself. She lived in pain. She lived in tears. The next thing, she fell sick and was diagnosed with hypertension. From there, stroke. She was just doubling from one sickness to the other. She never got well. And then, one day, she died. She died, oh! She died. Before she died, she told me that she wanted to be buried in this community. Then, we deposited her body at the mortuary. Again, do you have a mother? Ikenna! Do you have a mother who sacrificed everything for you to be okay while she's suffering? It's okay. Ikenna! Do you have a mother who was sick? 
Yet she went so hungry just for you to eat. He cannot have a mother who was insulted and persecuted because she did not have anybody to talk for her. You can know my mother went through all this just for nothing. Oh. Mama, oh. Mama, tell me, okay. Mama, I want to Stop. die. Mama, I don't want to stay here again. Mama, I want to tell you. Mama, I want to Mama, Mama, I want to tell you. Mama, I want to tell you. Mama, I Mama, 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 she told you everything. Everything like what? <sighs> Nothing. It's just the problems you are having with your father. Uh, in fact, her late mother's problem with your father. And the rest of it. Okay. Um, the truth is that um, we were little when those issues came up. I don't know what she has told you. Maybe to condemn my father or to protect her late mother's image. But where I stand is do not treat your sister or your brother as an outcast. That young woman you see, that young woman is my blood and that is where I will stand till eternity. But, but, let's not dig the ground. Because a lot will be seen. You're right. Chidi. Chikamso is my friend. It's not been long I met her. Her tears are wasting away. That young girl is seriously in pain. Over the death of her mother, Chidi. Please, help me take care of her, please. Yeah. Yeah. Um, the elders are already looking into the matter. Okay. Yes. That's nice. Uh, well, let's hope something good comes out of it. Yeah, um, it's their call. You know, but I believe that something good will come out of it. Yes. Thank you. All right. Take care. Huh? No, All right. Well, bye bye. Bye bye. Anene. Mm. We should try to see how we should visit the mortuary where Urema's body is kept. The daughter she comes to told me that she deposited money that covers for three months and it will soon expire. Mm, that's a good suggestion. Um, she comes or cannot uh, bear that burden alone. Yes. We must go. Okay. Because the way I am seeing it, as far as those men are concerned, to bring the body of that woman back here will be a great task. I have already started defending Urema and her children. There's no more going back. Duru was claiming the other day that the body of Urema can never be brought in this village for burial. Eh? I, I was surprised. Ta! Ta! Duru. Who is Duru? Forget about Duru. He has just spoken what he feels like talking. Is he God? No. My, look, my joy and happiness is that the girl says she's willing to swear with all the deities in this land for the body of the mother to be buried here. Are you serious? Forget that. Are you serious? Am I serious? Huh? Did I speak with water in my mouth now? Very good then. Allow me to carry the cross. Eh? What's it do? Consider it. Do. I do. 
They should have pity on that young lady and bury her mother. Eh? I don't even understand the way our women are at our times. Eh? What is the tradition here that a woman was banished and she moves along with the children? Eh? And the woman died and they're still saying no for her body not to be buried in her own village. It's not fair. Eberi, and your father has been the arrowhead claiming tradition this, tradition that. It's my, not fair now. My father? Yes, your father Duru has been kicking against bringing the dead woman's body in this land. Adugo, how do you know? Are you part of the Umunna? Or have you been attending their meeting? No, I want to know. Ebere, I am part of the Umunna till I leave my father's house. Ebere, you are part of the Umunna till you get married. Eh? Besides, everything is being discussed in my father's house. My father. It's okay. But, Adugo. If what you are telling me is the truth, then I will want my father to stay away from Chikansa's mother for not being buried in this village. Please, Eberi. Hmm? Chikamso is our mate. Chikamso is our friend. We grew up in this village together. She really needs our help. Eh? She's been in pain. She's been crying all day. Eberi, let me ask you. Do you really know the pains of losing a mother? Please, just talk to your father. Please. It's okay. I must talk to my father when I get home. No, I must talk to my father. What's all this? No. It's okay. Oh, I'll see you later. Just wake me up this early morning and you are talking what I don't understand. Eh, yeah. Ikena, for the past two weeks have I seen you? For the past two weeks have you done Ganya? Have I seen you? If you don't see me, you come to my house and see me now. Or are you talking to my ghost now? So it is true, Abi? Yeah, it is true now. You've been giving your money to that stupid girl whose mother was banished and returned back to their village. You've been giving your money to her, Akwaya. Get your man, go, go. Hi. Oh, oh. Is that the breaking news? Eh! Is that what you're saying? No, is that what you're saying? Look at this one, oh. stupid thing, shameless man. Look at you, ordinary conductor like you that I'm trying to manage. Auto passenger, that's what you are. Instead of you to be saving money to help your stupid life, you're here chasing women. Now I'm wearing cancer. Chasing women up and down, you think I will not find out? No, no, no. I'm not going to call you. See, eh? I will deal with you. Don't try me, oh. Yes, that's what you are. I feel. That's what you have always seen. So much fun with your people. And I'm chasing women around that. Mm. Thank you very much. I'll help you. Here you go. Come and leave my house. Eh? Leave my house. Me, that's my leave your house. But what's going on now? Look on you. You are not even happy that I'm managing you. You think I don't see all these fine, fine guys? So much didn't go. With big, big cars. Eh? They are far more better than you. Think I don't see them. Eh? Instead of you to concentrate on me, that in my mother, not sharp on Concentrate on me. Eh? You are following that stupid evil girl about. Hey, get him the good Turn that fire your mouth. Get the fire out of If you call the police, it's 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 I'm assuring you that you have the support of the majority. According to my father, he said all the king's men are gradually changing their minds. 
my advice for you is just be strong. Hmm? Be strong and stop shedding tears. Hmm. Adogo is right. Hmm? Stop crying. The spirit of your mother is at work. Yes. Huh? I called my father and I talked some senses in him. He couldn't even stand at his feet. After I finished talking with him, please. Ebere, mm -hmm. if only your father can see my heart and have mercy on me, I'll be so happy. My world has been torn to pieces. Mama, what you going was he here for? No, no, no. For instance, your word has not turned to anything. I always believe God in everything. Chi, do you pray at all? Because you have to put all these things to God's hands and allow Him to take control. Everybody knows Moya in this community as a bad man. Mm -hmm. That's why I warned my father to limit himself from any relationship he has with him. Chi, you heard what Eberi said. Nezianunne. Ne is a very good woman. Ne busisial madu eh. Do you know that Ne has been fighting for you? I'm sure you're not even aware that Ne assembled all the umada of this village just because of you. Just to discuss your issue. Chirapuzianu chukukobolugogo anwa eh. Allow God to fight for you. Allow God to handle this matter. Inugo. go. So, why is Ibuka your brother? Hmm. <sighs> what is it again, eh? Jeez. Is Ibuka dead? She don't start. Oh? Don't start, don't start, please. Don't start. Everything will be fine. Oh? Mama. I want us to discuss something. <laughs> what is it? If I say, I want to give you a small warning. Yeah. How can you raise your hand and slap chicken so? <laughs> hey! Ifoma, I have really suffered in this village. Look at this brato! Hmm. How do you stop me on the way and ask me stupid questions about chicken so? Oh, if you make it easy. Ifoma, who are you for me not to stop you? No, tell me, who are you? Are you killing me in Watuku that nobody can stop? Or what? Do you know you are very very stupid? You are very very hopeless! For you to have stopped me on the way! And started asking me questions about who? Take am so! Mm. Mm. I see. So you are now the dictator. You now fight for her, okay? Mm. But don't worry. We shall see. We shall see nothing! If I'm a, we shall see nothing if we want to see anything. Let, let, show me everything now. Yes! Show me anything! Chikaso is your senior. You can't even win her in a fight. Just that the poor girl is having a problem that is really affecting her life. But let me tell you, this should be the first and last time you will ever lay your filthy hand on her. Otherwise, we we'll draw the line. What will you do? We we'll draw the line. What will you do? I am telling you. You are very stupid. Stay away from you. You are very hopeless. Stay away from you. You are a fool. I am telling you. You are a very big fool. If I don't want to on the way, you are very stupid. Did you hear me? Who are you? You idiot. Carrying other people's eh? If a better thinks she has grown, I will show her that she's just working. Oh, Yobo, don't you ever allow that bother you at all. Are you insulting me or what? Because I don't understand you. Who is a berry? Who is a berry for her issues to bother me? Maybe it's too small. Oh, Pekka. I'm only telling you this because I will surely pluck off one of her eyes one day. 
so that you will not be surprised. Imagine what I'm going to say. Hey, that's my daughter. Eh? Hey, now you are talking. <laughs> hey, let me tell you. Don't you ever, ever in this life be afraid of anybody. She has breath. If she tries to belittle you, show her Ihebo that you are a deformer. My daughter. Name, don't stress yourself over irrelevant issues. As a matter of fact, in this village, I have not seen that young girl that can stand up to me and I will not defeat. Anytime I want, I can pour her away. Who is she? Piam. She's so <laughs> small. Hey, mama. You see what I'm saying? You see Chidi. Chidi. Chidi, Chidi. Chidi. Chidi is making me angry. You asked him to get water for us to use and cook. And he has not done that. Later he will finish the whole food. Why are you disturbing yourself? Eh? Oh, the, eh? Forget Chidi now, Biko. Oh. Eh? Nobody. Biko. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. What I am saying is that we have to follow her to see her mother's uh, body at the mortuary. Uh, because uh, she came to my house uh, to sort my assistance. That's a good idea. So that people will know that she has people. For her to go there alone is somehow, you know. Uh, well, when do you think we can go there? Uh, we have to ask her. Yes. But she must go with, uh, go with us. Yeah, of course, of course. She must go with us. Of course. Or do you know the way to the mortuary? <sighs> And then, your questions are always funny. How can you ask me if I know the way to the mortuary? Oh, good day. How does my question look funny now? Okay. Have I gone to the mortuary? Yeah, okay. Ah. okay, okay, okay. No problem. Um, I will have to go to the uh, and talk to him. Uh, how is it? It's okay. I'll see you there. Thank you. You are very wicked. Please, please. I am going out for work. Mm. And I don't want your bad luck this morning at all, Pico. Eh? Mwa! Jatima, bad luck. You are calling me a bad luck. Why won't I call you that? Tell me, why won't I call you that? When you have chosen to be a headache to me. Mm. If not, why should you address me as a wicked person this early morning? You see it? If I say that, they will say, Jatima, you talk too much. Jatima, you did this. Jatima, you did that. See, if you're not a wicked person, why haven't you been to my house to know if I'm alive or not? Why haven't you been to my house? <laughs> Wait, oh. are you not the same person that warned me never to step my feet in your father's compound again? Oh, oh, so you now want a common conductor to come and see if you are left or dead? It's not possible, my dear. Stop all this gra -gra eh? Stop fooling yourself. Have you not been seeing that banished girl? Again, look me in the eye and tell me that you've not been seeing that, that banished girl. Banished girl, like you called her, is whom I am in love with. That banished girl does not harass my life the way you do. That same banished girl has an attitude that spells good. So, whoever gossips to you, my dear, should continue because I am going to pay her bad price soon. <laughs> Nonsense. Oh, could you see Boko? Look at this one that I'm managing. Eh? Is it because I like you? What about this guy? Yo? See, people have been telling me not to associate with you, but I ignore them. But now I feel you're going to need it, okay? You are now okay, Abby. See, you see all the money you've been borrowing from me. All the time, Jachima, give me this. Jachima, give me that. Go on in there, give me all my money. Suppose, suppose. Give it to me, Kita Kita. Who has been borrowing money from me? You! Moa has been borrowing money from you as a Nana Marwaja. Huh? Come on, get her from my house. Huh? Eh? Look at Mwa, me. Who the fire you here? Abi, don't let me lose it. Eh? Don't you? let me lose what it. What will you do? What will you do? Nonsense. Uh, uh, Look at him. From all day. You see, okay? Nonsense. You see now? Nonsense. You get now? Hmm. But you can't ask me. She can walk well. Mm. 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 Mm.
Um, she went out. She went to an Anna's house. They invited her for something. Mm. I hope all is well. Mm. Yeah. Mm. All is well. I think um, the woman they want to follow her to Ufuma to see her mother's body in the fridge. Uh, that will be tomorrow morning. Um, okay, um, uh, please, do you know the time they will leave tomorrow? Why uh, Toto? In the morning, so that they can come back the same day. Why do you ask? Would you like to go with them? No, don't worry, Mama. Okay, when she comes back, eh? Tell her I came. I will come in the morning before they leave. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mama, so bad, don't worry, I'm okay. Fine. Fine. Chidi, I want to thank you for being a man. Yes, men are not only having long things in between their tiles, but standing firm in saying the truth. Eh? I've heard how you've been defending our friend Chikamso. I want to tell you thank you. Oh, Jiseke. Oh, yeah, Thank you. I will shout to whoever that cares to listen that Chikamso and Debuka are my blood. They are my father's blood. They are Ifoma's blood. But what's confusing me is why would my father be treating them this way at this point of Urema's death? <laughs> like they said, some charms were buried and the woman was banished. All that happened in the past, nobody. Yes, we believe it is tradition. But what I don't understand is why is your sister Ifoma being cruel to Chikamso? Is she not aware that Chikamso is her own blood? As I talk to you now, nobody talks to me in that house. Eh? Yes. Whatever I do in that house is a crime. If my father will find a way of throwing me out, he would have done that since. But my prayer is that Chikamso will succeed in burying her mother here. Amen. Ah, ah. Let me tell you. I've warned Ifoma to stay away from Chikamso. I've warned her to stay away from that poor girl. Oh, the day I will strike her. See, uh, let me tell you. If they should leave Ifoma and uh, Chikamso to test their strength, I know definitely Chikamso will deal with her. No, oh, but just because Chikamso, she's still having a lot on her head. Mm, okay. Yes. I'm mm, just saying, oh, it was your lazy boy, madam. It's only God that will reward you for protecting your own sister. Thank you, thank you, thank you, and um, I will still thank the both of you for standing solidly behind her. Okay, thank you very, very much. Okay? Chikanso is our friend. Yes. Chukonaka is a Chukosin Milo guy, the no marker. I know Chukosin Milo. Thank you very much. Please let me run. Let me okay. go and check my trap. Yeah? Oh, okay. That's All right, nice. take care. Bye. Bye. Hi. Chidi Abusia, lazy boy. I'm telling you. You will not see his type. You will not see his type. Hmm. I'm not going to go to the house. I'm not going to go Aren't you ready yet? I'm not going to go to the will be waiting for you. I'm ready. Oh. Go inside my room. You know that cupboard near my bed? Eh? 
Open it. He got full con con custard, Ochie. There's money inside it. Bring it. Money. Mama, you still want to give me money after everything you have done for me already? Hey, Mba, no, no. Hey, Mama, don't worry. Eh? I still have some money with me. Uchiano, I know you have money. Keep it. You have been fetching water for me. And I remember your mother. One name worry for Buna. It was your mother, Buna Nilini. She gave me food. She invested my my farms. Let me contribute something. Oh, um, watch your wait here. And hurry up before they come. Pick up. Thank you. <coughs> <coughs> hey. Oh, oh, Fabio, go for oh. Nani, no, no. 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 The ball out. Ah, ball out, mo. Eh, no. Also, na Fabio go kwa. Na, unko uno. Uno manuzo, eh? It's good you're here early. She will pay for your transport. Oh, each one man, no. Eh, me unko di wena me soro. Oh, no kwa. Okay. Ah. Good morning, everybody. You can you I want to know if they are ready so I can take them there. Take them where? Um, Chi, yesterday when I came, Mama told me that you people will be going to Fuma to see your mother's corpse. So I came with my guy here to take you people there. Is it one That makes it easier for us. I don't know. Yes, what was that I was saying over there? You told me we were going for each other. So you are the one that wanted to do this. Uncle Martins, please. Please don't disgrace me, I beg you. You see that young girl over there? She has seriously been in pains. And I have decided to help her just to take them to Fuma to see their mother's corpse at the mortuary beacon. Oh, please. I can see you're losing your senses. Who will pay for the transport? Martins, uh -uh, please, I will pay now, I will pay. Okay, Martins, see, eh? while we are walking, don't give me no one night at all until the home is complete. Mm -hmm. Do you know if I have fuel in this car to take you to food? No, I'm asking you. How do I get the fuel to take you to food and come back? If I let me pay, I will not do this. Okay, Martins, I'm not, okay. Okay. I'm not going to waste my fuel because you have some kind of a day you want to help. Ogamata, this people are waiting for us because Ogamata is not doing this. I will not my lips. Ogamata is not doing this. I will not. Tell them to enter. Let us roll so that I will drop them and come back. The Biedimba is still very much alive. He was the one who dug up all the charms that was buried. What did I do? I simply told my father's wife not to bring a man into the house. That was all. Are you not aware of it? Oi, I am aware. But what I am saying is that Urema is dead and gone forever. So, 
you do not have anything to fear or worry about. Um, I am of the opinion that her body be allowed to be brought home because of her daughter. Mm -mm. That will be a taboo. A taboo. Duru, it has never been done. Not even in the days of our forefathers. No. It has never been done. Evil doers from this village that are banished end up there. So why should we be lenient now? Why? why My daughter there? cried and spoke in a way she has never done all her life. She also has been a childhood friend before the banishment. And I see reasons with her. Why? Please, I'm appealing that the body of Urema be allowed mm. to be lowered mm -hmm. here mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. to end all this issue. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Duru, not while I'm alive. No, it won't happen. Duru, allowing the body to be buried here is as good as allowing the children back home, which is a huge risk to me and my family. Who even knows the plans they must have they must have had with their late evil mother? Who knows? No, 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 no. Don't allow that. What happened? Just have your drink and and then go home. Oh. Please have your drink. No man. Why I come to see so I have an email. Yeah. Huh? Mm. This is the reason I asked you to wait for us here. Mm. No matter how you cry, you have been crying, but you have not been able to affect anything. No matter how you cry, this woman will not wake up. Mm. Uh, your mother is being mm. well taken care of. Huh? It's okay. You see, her body does not even look like someone who is in the mortuary. Mm. <laughs> uh, Control your emotion. Yes. It's okay. It's okay. And the mortician said that she reminded you to bring your mother's clothes five days before the burial. The casket will be ready to with white stockings and gloves. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> It is you that is going to bury your mother. Your mother cannot bury you. You should not date her. Mba no no no. I'm not saying you should not date her. But see eh, I will make you suffer. Mma ataga ofo me tiko nana before you dump me for her. You will see it now. Kwa na villager. You will see. Daddy. Let me ask you. Did we take an oath? Do we have an agreement? Why, why all these things? Why are you bugging me? Can't you leave the common conduct alone? Please. I am just coming back from work. I need to rest. I beg you with the name of the Lord. Please. Dogu, Dogu coming back from work. You are just coming back from work. Office work. In a lesson all. Are you company now? See, let me tell you. You know all the money you've been borrowing from me. Give it to me before I disgrace you now. Oh, I'm going to let your pass. Now give me my money as well. Give me my money. Yes. 
let me warn you for the last time. This village will not contempt both of us. The day I will lose my temper on you. I know why I've been keeping quiet and taking all your insults. Daddy, I am not a doubt. I went to school and you know it. Do not push me. Do not push me, Daddy. <laughs> See this one? Oh? I went to school. I'm a graduate. Oneko. Blah, blah, blah. Look at this one. Oh? So you are now a. Do not have to be. 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 Do not have to Now leave my house. Hmm? I'm not going to I'm not going to I'm not going to I'm not You will not do anything. You can you if you touch me eh, I I met my canal. I will I will tear you to pieces. Look at see the people that I don't want to touch me now you see. No sense. Look at him. If I frock all the stupid boy, then look all the stupid one. God is such a Hey I've been wanting to ask you. How is your brother Ibuka? I mean, where is he? Is he not aware that your mother is dead? I don't want him. Ebuka is alive. But he's in prison. What happened? It was a problem he did not know about. He was doing well as a as an electronics repairer. Oh home. When his ogre freed him. He was the one helping the family. He tried his best to make sure that we are okay. Then the doctor prescribed this particular drug for Mama. He said the drug will help Mama's condition. It was still a book who tried his best to get a drug for Mama. One day, police came to the house and Ibuka was with them. Sister was in my shop. Oh. This guy brought a television to me that he wants to sell it. Sister, I bought it. I never knew he stole it from somebody. This morning, police came and arrested me. <laughs> I did not steal it. Keep quiet. I bought it. Shut up, young lady. Are you his sister? Oh, my Nemo. Yes. We are here to sell the house. The owner of the television house was buggled and a lot of items were cutted away. We don't know who is telling the truth yet, but I will advise you to allow us to do our job and leave. Hey! <coughs> hey, Bukana. Where is the television? <laughs> Since I sold it to somebody. <laughs> hey, Gokwano. Where is the money? Sister, I used the money and buy mama's drug yesterday. Hey! Fimo! Please. I am begging you people. My mother is sick. She's inside there. 
I can assure you that if she sees you people in uniform searching the house, she will die. Help me. Help me, Nieno Magadiko. Help me, I am begging you. One day, my day is no, she I don't know. know. My brother is not a thief. <laughs> I am very sure it's because of Mama's drugs that she bought, that he bought the, the television. Please, I am begging you to go to. Just stand up. I'm so sorry about your mother's sickness, but we must search the house. This is an order given to us by our DPO. Biko, no, no, no. Please. Okay. Let me just go inside and bring our things out. I can convince my mother that I'm doing clean up. Then I can open the window. From as well, you no, no, no. You can look in from the window. Because she is not really fine. Ibuka is not a thief. Well, let them that he is not part of the group that burgled the house. I have told you people that he is not aware of the story. Forget what you just told us. But don't let your man say. Both of you, among. What are you telling us? The police, I was not among. Mm -hmm. He just want to put me in trouble because he said I collected his girlfriend. No. Girlfriend, de quoi? I know you forgot we didn't see him pay. I went to see the DPO. They told me he was not on seat. And then the IPO told me that they were still investigating the case and I left the next day I came back and they still told me the same thing that they are still investigating the case and I left the next day I came back and they told me the same story. <laughs> that they were still investigating the case. <laughs> My mother died that same day. That was how Ebuka, my brother, found himself in prison. <laughs> the judge set the bill very high. <laughs> it was, the money was too much. And the lawyers abandoned the case and left. That was it. <laughs> so... How much was the bill? Fifty thousand. Hi. Fifty thousand naira. And since then, a Bukawan name has been in prison. Hi. A poor boy. A poor boy who doesn't have anyone to fight for him. Oh. Hey! Ebuka was the only person who was struggling and fighting for his mother to survive. Now, because of Mama's illness, Ebuka is in prison. Ebuka won a bambo! Ebuka won a bambo! Ebuka is not a thief. Ebuka has never stolen anything in his life. 
Mambona, my boy, Ebuka is a noisy. Ebuka is not a thief. Oh, now he's in prison. I don't know how he's faring. I'm a mukosi no do. I'm a no more rikwani. Ebuka one ne mo. Ebuka one ne mo. Ebuka one ne mo. Ebuka one. Wise one. It is said that it is only the coconut that can explain why he decided to take his own worker to the traitor. I have come to you because I know you are the only one who will tell me the truth about this uh, Urema's issue of burying uh, charms in Uwe's company. It's been so many years that Urema was banished. Yet something still hovering around us. Something still not right. What exactly do you want to know? Yes, a uh, wise word. I want you to tell me, Sushel, truly. Are you the one who dug out those charms from Moye's camp? I was the one that saw those charms when Moye ran to me and complained. I consulted the oracle and they told me Urema buried those charms. And all these things I'm hearing about her death and some men planning to bring her back to this community will cause earthquake if you dare try it. The daughter keep on saying consistently that she is ready to swear with anything to prove her mother's innocence. And she will die like her mother if she tries it. And you, her king's men, will bury her immediately it happens. Remember, I am a great Dibia. The only one who sees exactly what is inside the sea. And the only person that can tell you how many fishes are there in an ocean. Don't doubt me, Duru. Wise one, are, are, are you saying if Urima's dead body is buried in this community, there will be a severe consequences? I've said it and will not like to say it again. Okay. Okay. I think I've gotten what I want. My kinsman. <laughs> it's been three months now since uh, our wife, Urema, died. And her body kept in the mortuary. We are the custodians of our own culture. Let's talk like men and solve this problem once and for all. As men. Yes. So let us talk like men. men. Yes. And then you are saying we should talk as men. Of course. Good. I'm aware of the nocturnal meetings you've been having. The secret meetings you've been holding behind me. I'm aware of it. I'm also aware of the fact that you people went to see Urema's cops at the mortuary secretly. But I was only waiting for you people to bring that corpse back to this cup. You would have watched me eat you people alive. Ah, she? Moya, who are you? Moya, I am asking you, who are you? How many hairs do you have? How can you open your stinking mouth and talk to a man like you? Ah, do, do you think you are better than Hanen? Are you better than him? Is it because he has not built an upstairs in his compound? The way you have not also built yours. Shut up before I disgrace you here. Before we walk in Allah here. Me? I have my reasons why I kept quiet. When you came into this compound to sleep with my father's wife, I caught you red handed. Everybody in this compound. 
and that you are the one spearheading every movement we see now for her to be brought back here for burial so that you will continue to have mama. you will continue to sleep with her again here in death Ozuko, please it's okay we are not here for a fight neither are we here to test our powers we are our brothers Uwe, your kinsman is your relation we all have the same blood but you should know that you are talking to men and not babies she comes so say that she must wait to prove her late mother's innocence that's where i and most of us stand Bam. we will bury urema in this village and on her husband's land and we perform the traditional rites you will not eat us Eh? We must decide the day she will take the oath and bury her mother. I am ready. I am ready to swear to any deity. I am ready to swear any day, any time. Bring any deity. Bring the Bible. I am ready. Good. That's fine. That's okay by me. That's what I've been waiting for her to say all along. That she's ready to swear. But... Dibia Dimba must be there. No. No. Dibia Dimba. The gods forbid. I will not swear to that man. There are other strong Dibias in this community. There are even Dibias outside this community. Get any of them, I will swear. But not to Dibia Dimba. Duru. Yebe. Anene. Oye. Obele wopute na aru aru la. Ha! Oye mo obele wopute. Ilons. Oye. Amwa. Isn't it obvious there's nothing else for us to discuss? There are too many things to discuss. Because this evil child. Wo banshia. Cannot tell us how to do our thing. No, she cannot. She cannot. Papa. What is it? Shut Papa. up. Shut up. Just shut up. She said you cannot tell her what to do. Huh? Just get another Dibia or get a Bible. That's all. Thank you, my mm. son. You will live longer than your grandfather. Chede. So it has gotten to the point of you talking after me. Have you become my interpreter? That I do not understand English language anymore? Anyhow, I'll leave your case for next time. Uh, my people, I am no longer interested in her swearing to any deity or to the Bible or whatever. If you people like, you can go to the mortuary, collect her corpse, bury it anywhere but here. Yeah. Impossible. Oh, yeah. Ashe, get here. You cannot do it. We must take our final decision. And this woman, who remember, must be buried on this land. Do you see what I said? Look at him. Come on, tell him. I'll break you. Come on, I'll break you. I'll tell the police. 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 i will I am beginning to see this problem as a conspiracy against Urema. I am beginning to see uh, beyond. Uh, eh? Stop seeing. What are you seeing now? Get here now. 
When I said this thing before, you people thought I had something to do with you, Rema. Now you're beginning to see. Must that girl swear before Dimba? Yeah? We have plenty of uh, uh, native doctors, Dibias, in this place, in this community. Must it be Dimba? That girl has the right to say she doesn't want that man. I personally paid a visit to Dibia Dimba to ask him how was the charms discovered and who buried the charms. He told me again and again that it was Urema that buried the charms and warned that we must not allow Urema's body into this community. <laughs> I now remember. It was a uh, Muye that brought him by that day. Yes. Yes. Ah, now I see the reason why that girl does not want to swear before the mba. Mm -hmm. You said my mother buried the charms. Mm -hmm. Now I say I want to swear that my mother did not bury the charms. Mm -hmm. But I don't want to do it before you. Give me another person who is above the mba. That's what I am saying. The little girl must have seen beyond the Iruko tree. Bam! Eh? Hey! This one. Is it not the same Dibia? The same Dibia that messed up my family? Is it not the same Dibia that said my mother buried those charms right before my face? So, how can I then swear before that same Dibia? How? Chika Umam, you have made your point. And so shall it be. The good thing is that the people are supporting you. And our king's men are suddenly behind you. Mom, let us see how everything will play out. Inugo? Hi. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. What is it? Nothing, my daughter. Nothing. I'm okay. Papa, I heard all she comes to said. That she will not swear if it's Dimba that will come for it. How dare she utter such word? My daughter, let me tell you something. If not for the same Dibia Dimba, you all will be dead by now. It was the same Divya Dimba that neutralized the charm that would have killed all of you. Gabi Mushuno. He was the same person. So, Divya Dimba must be there. He must be there. Where you there? Papa, don't bother yourself about Chikamso's issue. She's too small. Opeka. And as for that Chidi. I heard all he said, but he must surely regret it. He must. Uh, 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 if you please, 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 please. Don't mention that name ever again. If you do not want me to have high blood pressure. God forbid. Please. Don't yes, mention yes, yes. that name again. Papa, you will not die. Hmm. Nothing will happen to you. You will not have high blood pressure. All I want for you to do now is to go inside and rest. You need rest. Okay? I know you very well. I know what you can do. Strike those your enemies. And as what she comes to, she must surely leave this village. Look at what she has done. She has virtually turned all your kinsmen against you. Hmm? Uh -huh. As for that witch, Aboma, 
that woman is just a devil. No wonder God didn't give her a child. No wonder she is in her father's house. But Papa, don't worry. Let's just calm down and think. Act fast and deal with them. Strike them. No problem. My daughter, go in. I'll come in later. Go in. God knows what he's doing. Please, come in. I'll come in. I'll come in. i good and kind heart. Thank you. Eh? You have been so kind to Chica ever since she came back. You, you know that day that you brought the boss and took her and her people to the mortuary? She wasn't expecting it. She was very grateful. Thank you, Thank you so much. Thank you, um, the truth is you. that I've come to realize that I love Chica so, so much. Huh? And I would love to marry her. But that will be after all these problems, isn't it? So that I will be able to take care of her. And I've heard what you said, and I am glad to hear it. Thank you. Eh? And I will support you to the last. Thank you, Nia. Thank oh. you. But, like you said, we don't have to tell her. Until after all these challenges around her have been taken care of. She really needs someone to look after her. Mwa Taka Fufu. Yes, and then, even before then, I would like to change this my conductor work so that I will begin to work in a big company for me to be able to take care of her very well. Oh, I'm going with you. Mm, thank you, Mama. So Just pray. Everything is in God's hands. Chukwa Biyama knows our going and our coming back. Now, we must see if any. Yes, Thank you, Mama. Oh? Thank you, Mama. Chukwa Biyama will help me as well. Because I don't want Chikam so to suffer again. Or suffer go too much. Yes. And mm. um, no. mm. um, please take this money. Give Chikam so two thousand and keep one thousand to yourself. One thousand just. No problem. No Rikawa. No sir. Thank you. Hello, mom. Is there a way to make it? I will tell her. Chuku go see. Thank you. Eh, eh, be fast. Oh yeah, nyapa yoso. Amen. God bless you. Thank you. Not of my own. Are you sure you have enough for your transport? Chuku ego bo. Iji. Mama, chuku go nje alam so badra. Hello. Man, not of my own. Oh na, chuku dube yo. Thank you. Oh na, hi. You see that young man again now? He has a good and kind heart. I've been watching him. Do you know he came today to see us? He even gave me money. 3,000 naira. He said I should give you 2,000. And keep 1,000 for myself. Yeah, hold it. Hi. Hold it. Hey. Somebody that I just met on my way mm. back. And since then, he has been so good to me. God will bless him. God will bless him. Um, no more Kwanu. There was something he told me in confidence, Ma. Uh, I said I will not tell you until the time is right. Something like what? I'm saying I will not tell you. Nah, Jopam. Mama, you can't do that now. Mama, tell me. Please now, Mama. Please. Okay, Mama. I'll bake pumpkin for you. Meet Teliake. Mama, now tell me. Tell you. you like to deceive me. <laughs> I will tell you. Uh, he said. He said he loves you. That he would like to marry you. 
Oh, Mama. Honestly, I don't think I'm ready for anything marriage now. Let's sort uh, Mama and the uh, Ebuka's issue first. Then, after that, we can start thinking of marriage. Oh, Fangwalia. That's exactly what I told him. I said, wait. Let us sort out the challenges around you. We will go to marriage. That's good. Okay. But he's scaring me. I like him. He's scaring me. Uh -oh. You know, somebody that can squeeze out from the little he has just to make sure that you're okay. He's scaring me. Oh, for family, consider my Huh? Yeah? You're beginning to consider the young man. Oh. No. If I let him make way. Man, this life is mysterious. Now look at Jude yesterday, my man. Hi. <laughs> now, my man, this abroad is my next target. I need to come to that place, my man. You cannot believe that all the places I applied for jobs, these people are turning me upside down. No one. Oh, wow. So since then, what have you been doing to survive? Now, Jude. Is this my cousin's husband? He has a boss. And I follow him as a conductor. Though the man has been helping me. So I still survive from there in this town. I manage. Sorry, take this guy. Hello, Bam. I'm the kid. Okay, I deal with my friend here, yeah, my that my classmate I told you about. Uh, that one I told that gave me money to complete my flight ticket. <laughs> yeah, I just deal with him now. Yeah, no problem. I'm coming, I'm coming. Alright. Who be that? Ah. And my cousin brother. Mm -hmm. This guy. You will not believe it. This guy entered Malaysia under two months. <laughs> this guy will be very good. My mom, I need to pay with that to pay Shamek and watch some dollar. Give me that. I'll get some money. And the car mother, I know I see him, so yeah. No day easy. Now look okay if you day here, I can't get one day. Guy, yeah, what's up now? Kiss and cage is away. There's this place I would like to go to. And I would want you to accompany me, please. <laughs> and where is that? <sighs> I want to go and see a friend. And I've not seen her for a very long time now. Please, I would like us to go together. Okay, it's alright. But first of all, we have to go and see my cousin first. Okay. Maybe all of us will go together. No problems, no problems. Just drink up, they are waiting for me. What is happening? <laughs> Nothing. I came with my friends to see you. I've been busy all this while. I know you'll be wondering why I've not come. Ah, 
Yes, so. Oh. Even in me. <laughs> oh, I actually thought you traveled. Ah, me? Travel? <laughs> I didn't go anywhere. Even if I have to travel, you will go with me now. <laughs> <laughs> Please, you can don't make me laugh this afternoon because I don't have strength. <laughs> You're welcome. Good afternoon. Now are you? My dear. <laughs> You? <coughs> I did not steal it. Be quiet. I bought it. Shut up. Young lady. Are you his sister? Yes! You! You stole you, you stole stolen television to my brother. You are Ebka's sister? <coughs> yes! Yes! Jesus Christ! <laughs> What's going on here? Eh? Ifan? Where is he? Ebuka, my brother, is still suffering because of that case. Oh, Ebuka, my brother, is still in prison. I have not even seen my brother since. I don't know if he's still alive. How? What, what, what is happening here? Ifan, what's she talking about? You remember a story I told you about a stolen television? Okay. Her brother is the innocent boy I sold that television to. And now she's telling me the guy is still in prison. Since then, Hey! Ebuka! Ebuka, one day more! But the court granted us bail. Yes. 50,000 Nero here. Ebe, can they be 50,000? Where did I give 50,000? My mother was dying then. If you remember, when the police came with you people, I begged them not to search the house. Two days, three days, two days after that day, my mother died. It's okay. My dear, it's okay. I am the one who sold the stolen television to him. I am the one who put him into that trouble. I must be the one to bring him out of it. I must do it. Just come down. Dalurinde, thank you very much. Ebuka wande mata gogo abufu. Ebuka suffered so much. Otaga abufu ezoku. Everything is fine. But. Anytime I go, I go to the prison to visit him. The warders will ask me for money. If I don't give them, they will chase me away. Up till now, Ebuka does not even know that his mother is lying in the mortuary. Oh man, oh man, I will go. Eh? He was only fighting for money. He was trying to raise money to save his mother. Oh, we go Jason, they are gone. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Which prison? The club. 
Eklovia prison. It's okay. If you have been asking anybody for anything, that must stop today. I am here. I am here to make everything right. Even if it's going to cost me the whole money I have made. Okay? Just be fine. Put yourself together. Excuse me. Yes. Everything I just told you. Just have it. I should take this. I Want you not to step your feet into this house again? What are you doing here? This eh? is my father's house, and nobody can stop me from coming to my house. May the highest thunder strike you there! You this Ewausa, so you don't have respect. You are talking to my mother anyhow. You don't have respect. Eh? <laughs> if I was not talking to you, please, I don't want trouble this afternoon. Chidi, you're going to help. Chidi, don't make noise here. Don't make noise in this house. If you want to see Chidi, go to that witch house where you were coming from. He will come and meet you there. Not in this house. Over get out. Chidi! I am talking to you now, Chidi! Chidi, why are you making this? You want to make this? Why are you making this? Why are you pushing me? I said get out. I should get out. Yes, you get out! What do you mean by that? I have torn a trace next time. Eh? What did I do to you? What 
Say to you people. Nka Kabumbido, next time you will not come into my father's compound to fight me. If I saw you tore my clothes because I came to see my brother. Nka Kabumbido, you tore my clothes. Try it again. Try it again. Look here, Kanene. Wajai, you are coming to my father's house to fight me. Are you not the most stupid girl on earth? Are you not very stupid? Are you not very stupid? Let's go and see. Come to my father's house to fight me. Come here. Come here. You're watching. Ogini, who did this to you? I went to see my brother. The next thing, Ifoma and her mother came out and started fighting me. They even tore my cloth. Chalepa, you went to your father's house and Ifoma and the mother fought you. What did you do to them? Nothing, no. Nothing. They asked me to leave. And I asked them why I should leave my father's house. That's all. Ogu. Oh, hey, Dara. Let's go and see that stupid girl. I need to know what is wrong with her mentality. Hey, no, 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 no. Please, you girls should not go. Don't go. It will look as if I sent you people to fight her. Please. And just leave her. It's okay. Eh? It's all right. It's okay. We will not go there. But you know what? Just go and change to something else. Hmm? We'll see you later. Okay. Um, thank you. I'm sorry, huh? No, come on, Kinka. So, hey, God, 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 I've suffered. If I wanted to say sorry to somebody, it is you, this Inchi, and you, this Anon Pama, that I will be telling that I'm sorry. For what? Instead of me to tell you that I'm sorry, I will go to all the mad men in this village. One year, Ruta, I am sorry. One year, Ruta, I am sorry. Yes! I will! I will keep Girl, you call your daughter. Where is she? I want you to ask that girl what my daughter Ifoma did to her. That made her beat her up, tore her clothes, made her naked in public. Where is she? Um, Do you know where is she? Boy, calm down. Calm down. You mean a berry tore Ifoma's clothes? Why? How? Did you hear me louder day? Where is she bringing out? Papa, I was just going on my own, peacefully. When a berry and a dugo came out from nowhere and pushed me. When I asked them why they pushed me, a berry slapped me. Before I knew it, both of them ganged up and beat me up. Tore my clothes, gave me sand and everything. Hmm. Papa? Hmm. Uh. Do you hear that? That that mad dog you call a daughter and a stupid useless friend. Ganged up to beat up my daughter. That's what they did. As we speak, I'm just coming from Anene's place. Over the same issue. Where is she? Oh, just calm down. Don't ask me to come to bring her out here. Hey, Barry. Yes. Hey, Barry. I'm dealt with She had come alone. Come with your daughter here. Come out here. What happened between you? Papa, is that why you called me? You, 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 you. I thought 
you called me for something important. And what do I have to do with people that have turned themselves to blood suckers? You are the blood sucker. Eh? How do you talk to my father like that? You, sucker. you and your father should leave this compound. Oh my! You and your father should leave this compound. You are you my koto? Make you koto? Ungenwe zibomba. You are your father. This is my father's house. No. Leave my compound. Duro, did you hear your daughter? Did you hear what your daughter just called me? She called me and my family blood suckers. No. Very well. I will teach you what blood suckers can do. Please, you please. Please, 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 please. Are you not aware that Informa here is your sister? Eh? God forbid! God forbid! Eh? Papa, how can somebody that doesn't know her own blood be my sister? How can somebody that has planned and sent the whole family out of the village be my relation, Papa? Oh! 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 I tore your clothes. And you're not happy, right? Same way you tore Chicken Sauce clothes. Let me warn you. If you're not careful, if you're not careful, Hey, 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 stop! Will you shut up, man? Don't will you shut up? You cannot control this man, dog. Hey! Will you? Oh, you are. I will help you. Don't you get that dog? Don't you get that dog? Don't you get that dog? Come and run! If you can't control him, I will help you control him. I will not finish you. Please, please. Because we are blood suckers. I am your brother. Ngosi or Twese are your brother. You are not. You are not. Please, calm down. Okay. I will handle it. Hey, Barry. Please. You get me? On a plan? Uh. For three days now, I've not seen you. You did not call me. You don't pick my calls. Eh? I don't like this your big man work, and I've been telling you this. Uncle Martins, it's not a big man work. There is a problem we have been trying to solve, and the thing is seriously on my neck. We have been running from police to prison, from prison to lawyer's office. I am busy now, please. Police? Lawyer? Um, it's not really a problem. It's just that we are trying to follow some due process to release somebody from the prison. Please. This your DPP lawyer police, I don't understand though. I don't understand. Have you changed your line of duty? Ah. What do you mean, Ogama Tins, if I have changed my line of work? I have not. I did not write any a resignation letter to you now. Did I tell you that I have resigned? Put somebody there first. When I'm done, I will come back to my work. Ikena, I should put somebody there. No, Ogama Tins, eh? see, see, don't No, let me understand. I should reserve the office for you. Ogama Tins, when you like, you tell me when Once to work. Once this problem is over, I will come back to the work. Okay. Let me have my money. The money you owe me. Um, Ogama Tins, just calm down for me, eh? Once I resume work, I'm going to get now. Once I start work, the money will be paid in full. Biko. This is running around. I don't want to hear anything more than this from getting my money. Ogama Tins. I will pay you two dollars once we start work, oh?
Mama, they are the ones I told you that came with the can of the other side. Oh, good, oh, good, oh, good. 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 Ah, não me anda. Não é. Olha o meu motor, mano, a gueu. Ah, o que é que não é? É o que? É não o que? Não quero nem mais nem bem 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 bem. Olha, olha, o meu motor. É muito ambo no aí. Olha, olha, olha. 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 I'm not going to be able I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do not you don't need to worry, okay? Ebuka will be out soon. No government and their Imana family will be again. Yes, but hopefully, it's coming out soon. And, uh, see, Ebuka is very healthy. Huh? I'm a man for you. I'm a man for you. Very soon, he will be with you people, okay? Ebuka, my brother, is still alive. Yes, He's alive. and healthy. And in fact, Inne, that was the first question he asked us. As soon as he heard that we saw Chikam so here. Mm. Hey! Ebuka! Ebuka Wanemo! Ebuka, your mother is dead! Come and see your mother lying cold in the mortuary. Oh, Chica, Why don't you have there? Mugo, Mama, somebody is there. Mugo, that his mother is dead. I am happy, oh. I am happy. Mama, I am happy. But how will Ebuka hear this? Mama, they don't hear Ebuka, they Can you go and Mama? Ebuka. Hey, you will tell him that his mother is dead. Oh, oh take him so big. Somebody should help me and tell him that his mother is dead. Ebuka will be hoping to see Mama. 
Ebuka will be hoping to see this woman who slept with empty stomach just for him to eat. Ebuka will be hoping to see this woman who was pushed away for doing nothing. Ebuka, let us Because you're entering somebody's car. Eh? And you're even acting as if you're entering an aeroplane. Hmm? See, that's one thing I hate about you. You think they carry something for mine, though? Huh. Hi. Jatima, since I knew you, I have never had the rest of mine at all. Ah, ah. Is it a crime to know you? Must you say everything you see? What's your problem? Leave the ordinary conduct alone, like you always say now. Mm -hmm. I was joking now. I was joking. I was not serious at all. And now you're using international anthem. See, as a fine girl, I've got to be very jealous of my boyfriend. Eh? Yes. Who is your boyfriend? Give one. You now. Me, your boyfriend. <laughs> Wait. I know your plans. Is it because you saw me entering a big car? <laughs> my dear, I am still a conductor. Those people you saw me with are my friends. So don't think that my brother has sent a big car for you to make a U-turn. Mm -mm. mm -hmm. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. You know, somebody was telling me that he saw you with one girl at Eziama. Okay. And I confronted you now. You do not deny it. That means it's true. It's true now. <laughs> oh, how come you now want me to deny it? So we can continue, Abby? <laughs> you have failed. Uh -huh. <laughs> Now, just me, who are those guys I saw you with the other day? See these guys, eh? Their cars are so big. Big boys! In fact, eh? Since, ever since I met you, this is the first time I'm seeing you roll with big boys like that. Just me, who are they? You see your problem? You see another insult? So, ever since you know me, this is the first time you're seeing me with something good. I, God, I have suffered. Um, please, I am tired, oh? And I want to have some rest. Biko, come and leave. I should leave your house. Leave my house, please. Me, Jatima, leave your house. Eh? I see. Eh, Jenna, no problem now. I will leave, yeah. but I'll come back again. Um, it was a bear that told me. But um, since you know that I'm back, why didn't you come back? You know, I I I went to Anisha to see my ogre, just to know if you'll um, settle me. I spent three days there just to make sure that um, I thought things over with him. You know, we've not really had time to talk about this your August issue. You served him for six years and he didn't give you anything. Hmm. Don't work all you. What actually happened? Hmm. See, uh, I don't know if I will say that he's an occultic man. Hmm? Yes. Even though people were telling me that um, all the boys that served him 
that he didn't settle any of them. But because I, I wanted to survive, I was hoping that my own story would be different. You know, only for him to just come up on the eve of the day he was supposed to settle me and um, started telling me that um, some goods were, were missing in the shop. And you still went back to his house? Chi, what, what can I do? For how long, for how long will I keep setting traps, eh, working on people's farm just to survive? And you know very well that my father doesn't have anything. Hmm? Since, since you told me, in fact, can we, can we just leave this story? Eh? Please, let's say something more important. Okay. I actually wanted to tell you that some people were here and that they are running around for Ibuka's freedom. Hey. In fact, they told me that right now a lawyer is handling Ibuka's case. Hey! Thank God. <laughs> this is the best story. Hey! Uh, let me just tell you the truth. I, I went to see my Oga just to know if he can give me some money. You know, I, I'm planning using it on Ebuka's a, a freedom. You know, since you told me that story, I've never had any good sleep. I've never been myself since then. Don't worry. Hmm? One of the boys gave me big money. Hmm? Hundred thousand! <laughs> I'm telling you, hey, it was that same boy. That same boy that I told you that sold that TV to Ebuka. Yes. Oh, yeah. Hey. Hey. Hey, money. I'm telling you, oh. I was very shocked. Hey. So that's why I wanted, uh, I wanted to see you. So that you can help me buy coffee for my mother. Hey. Then we start, you know, making arrangements small, small. We pay for canopy, buy the goods for the umbona, um, settle umwada, um, the people that we play music, and then the remaining money, we will now use it to, you know, just general arrangements. <laughs> that's a, that's, that's a very wonderful idea. You know, it's better to we'll start using it on all these things that you've just mentioned before you use it for, for something else. Hey! <laughs> come and see the big money, you will not believe it. Hey, girls! <laughs> My brothers, this issue of Umoi not allowing any other Dibia, if not Dibia, is becoming so worrisome. We have eight deities in this community and each of them has very strong chief priest. So, why don't we talk to him to allow one of these chief priests to perform the oath taking? I have been having the same thoughts because the more Urema's body is left in that hospital, the more the money increases. There are other burial rites that follows. Who will perform those burial rites? Her daughter, Chikamsu, doesn't have that money now. We should be concentrating on how to bring that body back and bury it. Once that body is buried, all these issues will be buried too. I am confused. Chikamsu said that as far as Dimba is involved, she will not swear. Nuye said it must be Dimba or no burial. Do we invite other villages in this matter? Which villages? Which villages? Ilonze, yeah. this is our cross. Yeah. And we must carry the cross. Were those villages not there when we banished the woman from this village? Eh? If we involve other villages in this matter, it will look like we don't have capable men and hands to, ask, to handle the issue. I think uh, we should support Chikamsu. One is that it was Dimba who confirmed that uh, Urema buried those charms. Chikamsu said that her mother told her 
that she is innocent of the allegation and told her to swear with anything. I am of the opinion that uh, the young girl is afraid that what befell her mother will repeat if Dimba should involve. Nah, why don't we forget about this Dimba? Let's take Dimba out of it and invite another Dimba. Ah. Mm. Which means we have to talk to Mui. But my problem here is talking to him is not even the problem. The question is, will he agree? This guy emptied his pocket to see that I traveled. But I wept when I came back. He told me he's just a conductor. So what's your plan? I'm still thinking. That's why I'm telling you. <sighs> now my mom. You made money in abroad. Now my man, he put the Lego. He put the Lego now, Bongo. You made a whole lot of money, my man. So what are you thinking? There is nothing too big for such a guy who emptied his pocket to make sure you traveled. Man, think well. <laughs> Uh, you, you know I'm I'm not so good in giving advices. <laughs> so anyway, um, I will think more. Uh, meanwhile, uh, what's up with the release of that guy? What's up? Yeah, you know they had a long adjournment date. The last day he appeared in court. So the lawyer told me he's going to be out in the next hearing. So hopefully, <sighs> I want to hope one night. Anyway, I must say, you've tried. When they try, you bagay bagum po. But she comes so. That girl, she has a soft heart. You know, I barely look at her whenever she's crying. Such a pretty girl. I really have pity for her. Well, um. Life is like that, you know? To some people, life is sugar. While to some, life is bitterly. Onubo. Isiboto onubo. Mano onuogi. Emale fako. Maikulubaibu. But there is something I notice about that girl. She loves her family so well. My brother, you need to see how this girl was begging the policeman not to search the house because her mother was sick. Ochori lose Mamiya. She don't want to lose her mother. I don't want to remember what happened then. Who is she? Who is she comes so to tell me what to do? To decide for us what to do? Who is she? Who is that little girl? Is Dibiedemba not a popular native doctor that everybody knows in this community? Is he not a truthful native doctor known by everybody in this community? Listen, it's either Dibiedemba is there or nothing will happen. Look, who are you? No, yeah, we have played around this for uh, a long time now. Uh -uh, we can't continue to dwell on this. Let us take a decision now on it. That's why we're here. Are we not here seated? No, yeah. Let us go ahead and take a decision. No, yeah. uh -huh. You cannot swallow anybody. Esinen, Gesinan. Esinan, Gesinen. Amamu, 
Why are you shouting like if you are bigger than all of us here? The young woman said that she will not swear if Dimba should be involved. Yeah? And she has her own reasons. We cannot take your own. Mba! We cannot take your own. Dimba is not the only native doctor we have in this community. We look for another person. Eloze. Eh? Eloze. This is my matter, not yours. Eh? It is my case and not yours. You cannot tell me what or how to how to handle my matter. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I remember what Dimba told me. If not, if not, I will not sit down here and watch Umoji say rubbish before me. What language was that? That is about your family, not ours, right? Yes, it then is. Then why did you have to come to us? Maybe it was a mistake. I did remember you came to us complaining. Now, it's your case. Yes. Mind your language. I should mind my language. Mind your language! Uh, the, the language, the language that I mind is that it was a mistake coming to you people. <laughs> it is obvious, <laughs> it is very obvious that you all have ganged up against me. Very obvious that you have all ganged up against me. But I shall tell you people that I am the Iroko tree. The Iroko tree that can never be moved. Hmm? That cannot be moved. Hmm. Let Chikamso go to wherever her evil mother's corpse is, is lying. Pick her off of that place and bury her anywhere, but not on my father's land, not even in this community. Period. Uh, oh, leave my house. Uh, uh, yeah, Dimba. Um, um, okay. Leave my house. Your own case. Leave my case. Your own case. Ara, Ara, come to us again. Hey, up here. Come with me, Dimba. MT, I hope there's no problem. No, I'm fine. T, you're a pretty girl. Please do not allow these worries to fade away your beauty. We are here for you, okay? Everything will be fine. See you guys. The truth is that she is not just worried about her mother, Ro Ebuka. She is also worried about her uncle who drove them out of this community. Hmm? <laughs> He is even insisting that the mother will not be buried in this village. Ah, uh, Ikenna, but you never told us about this. Nah, eh? You never told us about anybody uh, refusing that the dead woman should be buried here. Why well, uh, that he did not say anything like that? Uh, no wonder this guy is passing through these worries. Eh? But we call this is your uncle. Who is this your uncle? My... My father's first son. Hey, but don't worry about it though. Uh, our woman, woman is on the case. Hey! Nandi woman na abu obi abo. Nana obi. Woman na una ani ne buto obi. No obi hata amiri. So in this present generation, they are still behaving like this. Imagine my brother. Nasi, uh, uh, Jude. Let's fall into this matter and scatter everything. No one knows. Okay, oh, oh, okay, 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 Don't you think it's something we can wade into? No, no. Like I said, our own money is seriously on it. No, you have to go there. Ah, I don't know. Hey, I cooked for you. Eh? And it's okwa. Hey, hey, thank you. Oh, mm. God will bless you. Bless you too. Eh, hey, Ebio, hey, hmm? I have visitors. Okay. Hey. 
Um, this is um, Ifanye. He is uh, Ibuka's friend. And this is Hi. That is his cousin. Hi. Jude. Okay. Uh, how are you? Ademma. Emma no conductor. Ipupa, okay. <laughs> 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 um, welcome. Thank you, my dear. Let you get to come this sofa is meant for you. Nah, uh, Jude, I must eat this sofa prepared by this beautiful girl. <laughs> that is how she has been helping me. She cooks for me all the time. Me she me. makes sure that I never go hungry. I'm very sure you will enjoy it. Because you can't spoil it. You are serious. Well, not happy at all. We need to compare the meat. Eat at it. Hey, 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 so you put go on as in Korea Kata will to go to Korea. Now that we move on, I'm going to bunker. I'm going to move this over the shop. Now I come on, I tell me, be a village. I'm ready every day. I have food in a bogey. Chineke. Hey! Hey! Nne, this sofa is very sweet. What is your name, please? <laughs> My name is Ebere Chuku. <laughs> Ebere Chuku is written all over you. <laughs> mm. Hey! Nna, nna no no mo opa kamili e this man. No. Oh. Oh. Um. I better do. Please. Can you prepare something like this for me tomorrow? Because I like what you just did here. Yes. Excuse me, I can't tell you I'm going to say you see. I'm not interested in the All of us, all of us. I'm not going to say Okay. I will prepare for everybody. Thank you very much. Ebi, who are they? She can so say this. Ebuka's friend that has been helping Ebuka to come out. Oh yes, uh, she told me about it though, but I've not seen them since she talked about it. One of the boys ate my ukwa and asked me to cook for him. Hey, can you imagine? See you see trouble. See you see trouble. Maybe in a bush again. What is there now? Just cook the opera for them, eh? You know no talk. I'm not just a chop and whatever and everything. Yes, sir. I agreed I'm a bush girl. I agreed. But if you see the way they were eating my opera, they were eating it. I said, hey. and they said that I should cook for them. Yeah. I do cook. Do I know how to cook? Thank you, Naji. Yeah. Am I the one that ate your opera? Go and ask Zindo Bodo Ibo that ate your okwa now. Eh, Ibi, do you know that Ifoma and her father came to my house? If you see the way my father shouted at me, eh? That man is a very stupid man. Oh, we've not seen since then. They came to my father's house too. Eh? My father didn't even want me to say anything, but eh? I insulted the man. Mm -hmm. I insulted the man. In fact, I even walked out from him. Mm -hmm. That man is a wicked man. Very stupid man. They like my opa. They like my opa. No, just cook it for them. Yeah, I'm sure very well. Okay, bye bye. We'll see you later. Hi. Ah, Ikem. Um, I want you to tell me what do you want to do. Since you told me that the all the applications you submitted, 
is not forthcoming. No. Um, but to me, I feel you should go into business. You know, I don't want you to follow us when we're going back to Malaysia. Because we need somebody that will be here to take care of things. I and my friend will be sending back. Now, my bro, you know, I want to concur with what he just said. You know, over there, we're into streets full time. Now, I'm on nine on the streets. You have to go any hustle, na hustle, any way, in a way. We do everything possible to make money except killing and stealing. You know, um, I don't believe in extravagant life like some of our guys. You know, they make money over there, they squander and uh, lavish it on unnecessary things, you know. Now more I believe you by Akuluon or Yota. Mr. By thanking God who made it possible for you guys to survive in the street of Malaysia. Father, Father. I never knew his blessings and favor will come this soon to my friend here, Jude. It's only God who rewards all good. Thank you for what you did to check Amso. May God bless you guys immensely. Amen. 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 God will bless you too, honey. You are Okay, no. This is a check of 10 million naira. Take it. <coughs> Pay into your account. I want you to relax. Look for a good business that you put this money into. I believe that God will bless you because you have a good heart. You're a nice person. Uh, you, you know, um, my brother, like they said, you can never lose being good. Your good act is what brought you this today. And in my own little way, I will support you with the sum of two million naira. <laughs> so my guy, um, I'm going to transfer you the cash Hey, 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 my man, my man, get up, get up, man. Hey, stop doing that. Bro, stand up now. Stand up. This is nothing. It's nothing. My man. See, see, see. Look. That little favor you did for me. Save me from a lot. Um, what you told me about chicken soup. Everybody in that bus left her. You were not the only person in that bus. But she showed her concern to her situation. Because you are a great help to that poor girl. You are a nice man. That's why God is doing all this thing for us. For all of us. Um, hello? Thank you. Thank you. Oh, okay, sir. Okay, sir. Okay, sir. <laughs> all right. All right, sir. Okay, 
it's all good, it's okay, 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 Please get up, get up. Um, the lawyer called. So we have to go meet him. Ah. Oh, of course, yeah. Okay, no problem. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, no, yeah. 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 calm down. Yeah. 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 She would have whispered something. There were an break her deck. Because I'm ready for her. I've already gotten my hand ready for a death slap. So that she will go and call her dick tiger father. Tell but baby, I know one at each bunta. Each bunta. Okay, for me. Why put the angle in the G for me? Are you shy or what? <laughs> what shall I say? <laughs> I'm coming to eat my okwa. You, 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 you. You said you were coming to eat my okwa the other day. I didn't see you again. You lied. You didn't see me? Did you ask of me? Yes. I asked chicken to my friend. She said you didn't come. <laughs> Who will I ask? Aduko. Okay, it's your Is it true? It is true. Well, your name is Adugo. Yes. I like your name. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. <laughs> if you say Chikamso is aware, let us go to Chikamso's house and confirm from her. Okay. Okay. But if it's the truth, what will I do to you? If, if you are saying the truth, I will personally bring Ken. We'll flog him. <laughs> okay, okay, no problem. Let all of us go to Tikamso's house and confirm. And if it's true, you flog me, like my friend said. <laughs> mm -mm. We we'll use leg and trek. I get you, Kuzole. Ah, is that fine? You see, because where you have a exotic car like this, you want to trek. Ada come now. I call him today. Come on. Come. A very too good. You know that will buy you food for me, eh? Come and enter my car, yeah? Come on. Come. Come on. <laughs>
Mama. I called you to find out why Urema's corpse is still in the fridge. Are all you men trying to tell me that Moya is bigger than all of you in this club? Mama, who amongst us in this community is Moya bigger than? We are on this issue. And I am assuring you that soon Aye. we are going to settle this problem. Soon, soon, soon! Soon, no one in the open up, what can say, Maru? Judge, you are not so soon. I get a good soon. That is one word that I don't want to hear. Mama, when did you? Mm -hmm. When did you? people should do something. Don't misunderstand me. I am not saying that you people are not trying. Man, I'm not for Eh? Must we be a dictator in this community? We invite another Dibia. Kachi Kachi, so that her mother's body will be buried. On your bone is wake. In the labor, and I see you soon, soon, soon. It is okay. Please take my words. Eh? We are going to do it. Oh, God, what says the one? Don't get soon, 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 soon. Young man, it's a pity you have to suffer what you don't know anything about. Hmm? That is the type of country we are into. Country where the police finds it difficult conducting goal-oriented, conclusive investigations, thereby making the innocent ones suffer. And um, the culprit always seems elusive, while the innocent live as fugitives. Never mind, the most important thing now is that you're a free man. Hmm? Once more, I will want you to forgive uh, Ifai. He never knew that the item was stolen. And um, to portray that fact, he been walking around the clock to make sure you are free from the prison. Well, uh, I don't believe in all this. I learned a lot in the prison. A prison key of Undaka had to turn in what you have, and not off. I got to get down far and one half far and Why do criminals be walking on the road, stealing government funds, buying expensive cars in the name of government? My brother, I have forgiven everybody. Life is all about forgiveness. But I have one problem. I need to see my mother. I need to see her. This is my problem now. I need to see her because she was not feeling fine when I left her. Though I bought her some drugs and I prayed uh, for her quick recovery. But that was not enough for me. I need to see her with my eyes to know her condition. Well then, she's no longer at Ufuma. My mother no longer in Ufuma. Where is she? Where is she comes from, my sister? I need to see them. I was only hope my mom and my sister had before the police denied me the freedom of taking care of my mom. Please, I need to see her. Ibuka, you have to relax, okay? We are all going there together. Alright? But your mother is in Asia Mana. In one Aboma's house. What is the secret? You know how you guys left the village. So she's there taking treatment. Even your sister Chikamso is there too. So calm down. No. No. My mom back to Ziyama. Ebuka, it is true. Your mother is in Ziyama. But it's a secret. Nobody's aware yet. 
Now let's go and see her. Um, Ebuka, you don't need to go to the village like this, okay? Mm. Uh, we'll get you something better. Mm. Just put yourself together, all is well. Mm? Coming back from the stream, the next thing she collected my pot of water and threw my water away. Ima no bemi je no mili. See the time I'm coming. Oh, informer. Why is she doing that to me? Oh, one mess na me me. Oh, one mess na me me. Oh, 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 oh. The weekend has got balance. Oh, 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 oh. Hey. My mother is dead! My mother is dead! Oh, she got a girl! I see her grandma! 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 
Mommy, I go tell you, God will some knock on this young man. Mommy, promise me that you'll be fine now. Come on. Oh, you come back. Oh, come on. Me. Oh, She died in my arms. She was praying and speaking in tongues. You know, I told her that she went to walk outside town. On that fateful day, she asked after you before she died. I called some people to help me take her to the hospital. And the doctor confirmed her dead. I deposited her body at the mortuary. There. And that is where she has been till now. What's the next thing to do now? What have I not done? Ebuka, what have I not done? I have done everything. Moye, his wife, and the former. Ha! They have embarrassed me. They have embarrassed me to the core. Do you know that on several occasions, Ifoma even slapped me? <laughs> she slapped me just because I am begging them to allow Mama's corpse to be buried in this community. <laughs> but Ndio Mona have been trying, you know, they have been trying to see how they can solve this issue. Then Cheat. Hey, Maha Boka Madru. That Chidi is a brother indeed. He has been so helpful. God will bless him. And then, Nne, Nne Namoko, yeah? She has been trying as well. Nama. So, if I must slap you, <laughs> if I must slap to you, Biko, 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 please. Hey, Buka. I did not tell you these things for you to act or for you to do anything stupid. Mm -mm. I only told you so that at least you will know what is going on. Inuko, please. <sighs> Even when I agreed to swear to either the deity or Bible. Oh, yeah, now Akupu Akupu. Aku Olu. Noye is insisting that it must be the Biadimba. Nezienu. Ofu the Biadimba. And I refused. He then swore that over his dead body will Mama be buried in this community. That is where we are. Nemo. <laughs> They have tried. The bagumbo. I want to have a look at the Kadim. The Kadim. 
you are a sister. Look at the th kind of things you've gone through because of Mama. Just look at. Go and sleep. Go and sleep. Are you not coming? I will join you soon. Hey. <laughs> 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 Where are you going to? Uncle, I'm here to see you, sir. See me for what? Uncle, are we quarreling? Then you're quarreling! Your mother, your sister, all of you, they're dead, all of you are banned, you're banished! So what are you going to do? Listen, one step forward, you regret you did. Come see her, boy. Get out! Where is it? Don't you know him, Emuka? I'm a memo. Look at him. I'm a prison. Look at him looking so unkept. Listen, let me tell you something. Whatever plan, you, your sister, your, your evil late mother, as for me and my family, it will not work. This house is my house. And I determine who comes in here and who doesn't. So go away. Go away! You lie. This is Sibu Emoji. Yes! This is my father's house and I cannot allow you to insult my mother even in that. You are the first son of this family and I'm giving you S market days to show me where my mother will be buried. S! Takagi man. You, 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 look at this idiot. Shut up your mouth! Don't you ever talk to my father like that? You this ex-convict. <sighs> now I know. It is very obvious that you were injected with drugs that make people mad. That is why you came into this compound. To showcase your manpower. Yeah? Only, 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 okay? You're talking to my father anyhow. Come on! Get out of this compound, you this prison rejected. Where are you going to? I cannot assault you. I cannot lay my hands on you. But let me tell you something. I am your blood. She comes so my sister is your blood. If our mother wronged you, did I wrong you too? Did she come so my sister wrong you too? My sister, search your conscience. I do not want more. The God in heaven is watching everyone. I do not want more. Yeah, man. My son, thank God you are back. Finally, your your sister has been on this matter for a long time now. Fact. That your sister is a very brave woman. You know, banishment is not something you just go to solve like that. That is why we are 
coming all year down so that he would allow another Dibia to come for the oath taking. So if he does not agree, my mother will remain in the mortuary for ages. Oh yes. Yes. <laughs> because first he's the first son of the family. And secondly, because of the allegation that was leveled on your mother too. You know, that's why we want to we advise we want to trade with caution in the matter. Uh, so uncle, uh, uh, what are you advising me to do now? Because I'm confused. What do I do? Well, I would advise you to be calm. Why we follow him with caution? Your sister might end up swearing for your mother to be buried. You know, Woye is a very stubborn man. Very, very stubborn. That is why I advise that you remain calm so that we can follow it the way we are following it now. Um. We have followed this issue for a very long time now. It seems nothing is coming out of it. Um, but that does not mean we are tired. No, we cannot be. Hey, Buka. I also want to tell you that you have to tell your sister or whosoever that will do the oath taking to get ready. But, you see, if your sister and uh, Wu Yi continue to drag this issue, there will be a serious problem. Because the more your mother stays in the mouth, the more the bees increases. So you have to do something. And then once your mother is buried here, you and your sister automatically will return home. And there will be nothing like a banishment. Please. You have to do something. Uh, it's okay, my elders. I have heard all what you said. I really appreciate it. Thank you very, very much. Uh, I will be on my way now. Hey, wait, Evoca. The food is almost ready now. <laughs> I'm about to prepare something for us. Oh, yeah? oh, yeah? oh, I'm okay. Are you sure? I just finished eating. And you don't want to eat? No, I'm okay. Thank you, sir. Hey, Ada. Have you seen Evoca? Evoca. Which Evoca? She comes as a brother now. Oh, pussy one. Hmm. Is Ebuka back? Yes! Hi! Chineke Dalo. Hi. Just that, he has been running up and down for his mother's uh, issue. Aww. Poor boy. Yes. Hope he's fine. Yes. Um, hmm. I heard that people that went to prison, eh? They look like stick because they eat them. Um, Sour beans. Hey! Which one is sour beans again? Please don't insult me. Don't insult me. Eh, they used to eat spiced beans. Mm -hmm. Spiced? Yes. Although I've not seen people that are in prison, but I heard that Ebuka is healthy. Yes. Oh. Please go and see him. Try and see him. Hey, where is he? Is he, is he in Nayaboma's house? Yes, in Nayaboma's house. What stops Ebuka from going to his father's house now? You're asking me as if you don't know what is on ground now. Hmm? You know Nwoye and his problem. Nwoye hmm. and his problem. If not, that is where he's supposed to be. Eh? Anyway, that one's coming. <laughs> Over my dead body. I can never do it. Never. I can never swear under a man that accused my mother falsely of, of, of bearing charms. I will never swear under a man that made the village hate my mother and banish her. Ogendi. There are other strong Dibias in this community. Very strong one. In fact, there are stronger ones outside this community. And I'm about, about that. They should go and get any of them. And then I will swear and settle this thing once and for all. But if it's for Dibia Dimba, never, never, I will never do it. 
Don't don't tell me that. Ah. Ebuka. I have wasted my tears. I have been pushed. I have been slapped by 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 a little girl that I knew when she was born. I have been made to suffer in different ways. So Ebuka, I am ready to continue suffering. Let me suffer. I am okay with it. Let Mama continue staying in that mortuary. But if it's for me to do that thing Brother Moye wants me to do, never! Me, me, me! Go listen to your brother. Mama, you know I will not do it. I will not do it. Never. Mama, it is better for me to hang myself and die than, than to take that option of swearing on that Tibia Let me just die and join my mother. Mama, I will just, let me just die instead of that. I will just die. Mama? In a Baba? Miss Nanda, she will not kill herself. Don't worry, everything will be alright, but especially for yourself. Because you are not afraid that's what I mean. Thinking about so many things, sister. Sister, how do we bury mama? If I told you, say, let's bury mama, how do we bury mama? The casket, the payment of the mortuary. Sister, we need to buy mama a good clothes, a good casket. Sister, how do we do it? And the only money I have with me now is 20,000 naira that Ifani gave to me. Ifani also gave me 100,000 naira. Hmm, 100,000 oh. But I gave it to Chidi. I asked him to help us get a good coffin for Mama. And to also help us organize one or two things. Eh? So don't worry yourself. The most important thing now is for Mama to be buried first. You know Where is Chibi? I did not see him the last time I went to the house. Uh, he went to Anichao. Mm. He said uh, some of his friends invited him over. So he went. Uh, sister, you will take me to the mortuary tomorrow. I want to go and see my mother's body. Oh. Nizienu, <laughs> see Chibi. I'm happy to see you. Thank God. Hey. Hey. Now I'm going to be here. Hey. God is good. Hey. Welcome. I went to Anisha. Yes. Okay. I went to see some of my friends i went to beg them money on their on your behalf you know um even though chikamso told me that um some boys are working for your freedom 
you know, I've not been myself since since I heard about this. So, but um, after everything, they contributed uh, twenty thousand naira for me. So, please have it. Huh? Did you just say you went to beg for my sake? Did <laughs> Okay, it's just the two of us. <coughs> How can my brother be in trouble? <coughs> and I'll just be walking around. <coughs> but thank God, thank God you are free now. Please, can you, can you take it, please? Please. Just take it back. Thank you very much. Thank God I'm out. Thank you very much. I'm out. Keep it. Keep it. I cannot keep this in I got this money for your sake. The only thing you do for me now is just take the money, please. Please, it's yours. Bless you. Bless you too. My God will bless you. <laughs> Why are you people bothering me? Why are you bothering me? I have told you people that Urema cannot be buried here. Period. That's my position. Why do you want me to check my mind? Bia, 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 Ngoye. Yes, Urogi. Stop what you're saying. We haven't come here to ask you to change your mind or change your stand. No. I've just told you what we think is better. You, you can't sit there and be opening your mouth and talking to us anyhow. Be careful. You be careful. I mean, you be careful. You be careful. I've told you people my, 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 my stand. That two members cannot be buried here. And you want me to check? Listen, both of you. Let this be the first and last time you will come to this place to ask me to check my mind. As who? As who? Yeah. Yeah, who? Why are you so keen on this dingba? Why are you behaving as if you are the ego of this community? Ask him. Talking to us as if we are little children. Anyway, I will handle this all alone. Dibia Okwiti will soon be here to handle all this. And so shall it be. Anene, let us go. <laughs> Why are you afraid when it is obvious it's Surema that committed the crime? If her daughter swears that her mother is innocent, she will die. So the only thing for you now is to stop her from swearing to avoid the danger in it. Dimba. The girl is saying that she will swear. And the woman are also insisting that she will have to swear. I have done everything humanly possible to dissuade them, but it's not working. It is not working, Dimba. That is indeed a huge one. Since they refuse to listen to you, Allow them to handle it so that nobody will blame you when it happens. Oh, I can't look. <laughs> Dima, do you know they have decided to uh, bring in uh, Dibia Okite into the matter? That's what they're saying now. Okite is a well respected native doctor in this community. If they say it's him, let him come. But I see your family burying two cops. If the girl insists on handling the offer, to swear. No, no, no. Please. I don't want to bury anybody, please. I know what I saw from the guards. I listened to the guards. They spoke to me. That Urema was the one that buried the child. Urema might have denied to her children. And that is why the little girl wants to swear. And 
if she swears, she will die. Chede, we've heard all your father is doing to his own blood. I don't know why some men are so stupid. Are you killing your brothers to live alone? I wonder. Are you punishing people to go to heaven? When the Bible said that to dust we all shall return one day. See, I've tried to make him understand. But he still behaves as if the whole world is in his hands. He didn't make money when his mates were making money. He doesn't have any investment. But he will still shout at you as if he's the local government chairman. My father used to tell me that the drum beaten by the wind is danced by all the trees in the bush. Even the Iroko tree cannot refuse to dance. That is to say that one day we shall all dance to the tune of judgment. Uh, I don't have any grudges against anybody. I allow God in heaven to judge whosoever that is doing wrong to me and my family. See the year my brother is the one that went to look for money for my freedom. Whosoever the father have done to me and my family, I still have him as my blood. Um, we have all tried our best. Let us hurry up and finish the remaining part of these struggles. So I can come and make the family happy again. <laughs> make the family happy? How? So I can come and do the necessary things and then um, take my wife away. And who is your wife? <laughs> mm. chel, 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 chel. Who is your wife? Mm. Mm. She comes to me, of course. Now. <laughs> <laughs> she always will. Imagine. She? Please, oh. I am not your wife. Is it the fact that you come here every day and we welcome you? Or because the other day you came with your ogre and took us to the mortuary to see my mother? Is that what is making me your wife? Yeah. Please, oh. I am not ready for marriage yet. I am not even thinking about it. I am thinking of Mama. One day, all we go in. Para para one. No, we go in. Chai. Para para para. She said that she's not ready for marriage now. Nah, relax. Relax. Hey, Georgia. No, oh yeah. <laughs> Speak, I am hearing. No, good night, man. No, I don't think I can have a book. And I'll just say no, never did. I can't get it. I just wrote the day news. Who is that man? Ah. Oh. Anum. 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 Keka. Eh. My daughter. Your mother may have lied to you to prove that she does not know anything about the charm. While she is actually the one that did it. 
Now, do we go on? Or do we forget about the swearing? But let me warn. For to be forewarned is to be forearmed. The end of this is death. Speak! Who could you speak? Oh, yeah. Evil child. Oh, yeah. no, why are you? My mother couldn't have lied to me. Because it is very rare for a mother to lie to her child. She said she did not do it. And I believe her. I trust her with all my heart. I will swear. Good. That's what I've been expecting to hear. Mm. That's good. <laughs> the God of truth. Akade Buchuanwa. Ibadam is your good. Over a way, that's an Madubuya. Or to a way, no one has an obeluter. Now hold this. Take, take it. Now say after me, if my mother is innocent of this allegation, let her body be brought back and be buried in her husband's land. If not, let me die within seven days. Stop! 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 Please stop! Stop! Speak! It was a conspiracy against Urema. She was innocent. Moye planned it all and sent the woman away. Hey! Urema never planted any or buried any charm. I am only saying this for me to be free. No, 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 no. Shall not be buried in this community because they are banished even in death. If any of them is buried here, their families, their families are going to lose a head each in every seven months. Hey! 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 Hi, my people. Wangan. Hmm. Did you people see what happened? 
What a wicked world we are in. Huh? Why should people be this hard hearted? Yeah. And then, I personally went to Dingba's house and I asked him to tell me the truth. But he insisted that Urema was the one that buried the chance. <laughs> okay. Now that we know that Urema has been vindicated by the gods with his children, what happens to those corpses? Let Moye's wife and daughter handle that. No! We must go and help them dispose of the dead bodies. Okuta, who? We? Who is we? <laughs> of course. Okuta, the Dibia did not say that our family was involved. Though. Oh. <laughs> and for Moye's family, eh? the head that steers the beehives gets the pains of this of this thing. Of course. It's really a pity. I thought Dingba was a good Dibia. Yeah. I know what it took me to convince Wonye on this issue. If not, he wouldn't have agreed. Oh, we thought Duru. you were supporting Wonye. <laughs> Duru, what did you tell him? Because I was surprised as he was sitting and watching even when he had sworn that no other Dibi will do that. Tell us what you told him. <laughs> that is a story for bottles of power. <laughs> I will tell you. You want to tell me? I will So Moye was the brain behind the real mass of I What a killer kid your chat. A poor widow that was trying to survive. Oh bring corner me wrong. Hi! Wanka. Let me tell you, children, no wicked man on this earth shall go unpunished. Kezimoye today, the punishment that will come his way, even in death, nobody can imagine it. If the way they connived to drive that woman, banish her from this community, eh? The two of them will suffer, even in hell. Fire, we have to hell in this. I put your mum in. I don't buy your mum. Hey, no wonder. No wonder he was so full of himself and turned into a tiger all of a sudden. Huh? So, Chi, when will your mother be buried? Cause I know the whole village will be eager to witness your mother's burial. So finally, Chikamso's mother will be brought home. Ah, to Finally, finally. Hi. 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 Just look at it. You are the only person that helped me bury my father. What if I'm having issues with you? What would I have done? <sighs> Did you see how your father ended up? <clears throat> he was the one that was not buried in his own father's land. You have to move him a mile before we could bury him. This is a very big lesson to everybody. Yeah, you're right. But um, I've uh, cleared your mother's room, so I would want you to 
talk to Chicken so let both of you come back home because um, you can't stay with Aboma forever. Uh, this place is okay for us. We have become part of Ne and uh, beside, I don't want to receive any insults from your mother or Ifoma again. Says who? Huh? That house is your house. That house is built on your land. You are the father we are looking at today. If a father leaves his home for a woman, sorry, I'm not saying it's a taboo. It's not. But you people have to come back home. In fact, if you don't come back home, I will leave too. If you don't want me to do that, then you people should come back tomorrow. If I'm having issues with people, who will I fight them with? Huh? We need to stay together. Plan things together. Please, come back home. Okay, don't worry. I'll come home, okay? Are you sure? I'll come with my sister. Good. Tomorrow? Yeah. That's a promise. If Oma and her mother are still living there, never. I will not. Never. One thing I learned in life is forgiveness. They have done their worst. Yet the truth is out. Do you think that Ifoma can still look at your face? Or do you think that Ifoma can still talk to you like before? Her tiger is dead and buried. So we must go back to our house. That is where we belong. That is our family house. People have seen twins and know the way they relate. You will know it's not because they are twins, but because there's a cord that binds them. They even relate better with each other than with the rest of the siblings. All of you are of Ezekiel's blood. The same blood runs in your veins. I don't know what happened that made Woye misbehave. You, know, you, you see, when the head of a tiger is cut off, the rest of the body becomes a chamber 
for the vultures. Omo de la lande aturiozu. I want you people to learn from what happened to Oye. Do not let anybody come between you people. You must stick together because united you will stand. Manu Tisa divided. You will fall. Oh no, where well no where Baliam. I just hope that you people have learned from Oye's experience. You are not my children. You need to believe in yourselves. You know what is good and what is bad. Do the right things. Do the right things so you will fulfill your destinies. Chica, Chica, Yoi. I want a lot. Once in a while, you come and see me. Take care of the one Problem. Is it money or what? Yes. We don't have enough money to do other things. So we decided to bury her first. Uh, no, 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 no. Bano. Hmm? Not when I'm still alive. Not when I am still alive. If this woman should be buried here, let the whole village come. In fact, let the whole world come and see that this life works like magic. This life is just like a standing fan. It blows from this angle to the other angle. Hmm? Chikamso, um, will two million naira be enough for your mother's burial? For the, for the two million? Huh? Hey. With two million, everything is done. <laughs> um, in addition to what my brother just said now, um, I'll add 500,000 now. Hmm. Hmm. 
he came and tried. Hmm. He said he'll be back before the burial day. He gave me this. Check of one million naira. Which he can? He can, you know. He can is an international businessman now. He travels for a business. That's why he's not here. So please take this check. Ikenna, you have tried for me. Oh. My God will bless you. If any, my God will bless you. something I believe about life. Whatever that happens is God's wish. There is something we don't know. We don't know that people we oppress today might tomorrow turn to our oppressors. Life, my God. So be calm. Please, hmm? calm down. Whatever it is, your mother is a winner. Yes. So please, hmm? pick up. Okay. Osuka. Hmm? Osuka. Hmm? If I had to go more. Hmm? Just calm down. Anyway, um, we'll be going back immediately after the burial. Maybe when we come back again, if you guys are still not married or you are single, then we'll begin the process. Which process? Marital process. So, how long will you guys stay before coming back? Um, we do come back often, but it's depending on the kind of job we have at hand. So, we don't really want to rush anything. <laughs> well, um, our friend Ikenna will be around to be giving you girls any gift we send. Ah, Ikenna, is he not that conductor? <laughs> yes. Ikenna, you know, is now a big boy. Hey. Ikenna is a big boy. He's a dude. Okay, but hmm? that's by the way. Um, we will be coming for the burial. Hope you girls will be around. 
Yes. 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 <laughs> the date you have chosen is good for us. It's okay, Baron. Yes, um, and I must say that uh, since you boys have said you will do the burial rites, eh? What is left is to conclude on the follow-up. I am saying that we should give the parish one he got. You know, this is a case of punishment. You know, and the palace is, uh, is aware of our troubles. Though the late Igwe wrongly banished our wife and our mother. Hmm? Uh, due to wrong information. So uh, I am saying we should give the palace one he got. And also tell the palace that uh, we have put the past behind us and that we have forgiven those that need to be forgiven. Another thing, Okute spoke with me in confidence and said and was suggesting that we should at least buy one local cow and kill. Mm. Uh, so that at least people will know that the children of uh, Urema killed a cow for their yeah. mother. <laughs> and yeah. also, you know, settle some relations and yes. all that. So yes. since he's not here, yeah. I said I should um, actually present it. Uh, okay, you? Yes. I am so happy for you boys. So happy. Eh? <laughs> In that case, yeah. Let me get deep, I'm going to hurry. Hurry. Get us. Want to slap me again? Slapping you has been the worst thing I've ever done in my whole life. I am very, very sorry. I never knew that my father lied against your mother. Please leave me alone. Hapamaka, I am not your sister. I am not your blood. If I see my sister, I will know. You pushed me away for doing nothing to you. Monageji Doko. Don't you come so please. Please, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I am very, very sorry. If I had known that doing all those things to you was hurting myself, I, I wouldn't have done it. I'm very sorry. Please, forgive me. I'm very, very sorry. I am bleeding from the depths of my heart. One name, Biko. Biko Baharom. I am so ashamed of myself. Please, I'm sorry. Biko, Biko. You see, have you seen all I've been telling you? Huh? Even if you wake up every day, you will still see Ebuka and Chikamso. They are your blood. They are our blood. Don't kill your sister. Stop slapping your sister. You thought maybe, maybe I was mad. Have you seen it? Chikamso, please forgive me. Chikamso, please. 
I know I've wronged you, but please, my dear, please, you have to forgive me. I'm very sorry, everyone. Please forgive me, all of you. I'm sorry. I'm please. sorry, please. I'm sorry. Please forgive me, my sister. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, please. My father deceived me. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, Nico. It's alright, it's alright. It's okay. It's okay. It's alright. Okay. Right. Okay. Right. Stop crying, okay? Good. See, I'm going somewhere. Why not come with me? Don't worry, you will know where when we get there. Eh? Hey, but clean your eyes first. Clean it well so that people will not. <laughs> okay, we're coming back now. <laughs> See, buy me something though. Okay. Buy me popcorn! popcorn. <laughs> oh boy! <laughs> What happened? How? Who is this? I am here. How can you ask that kind of question? Why is my one name? Is it true? Yes. I say yes. Are you sure? I do go. Hey, baby. Please. Find a place in your heart and forgive me. You both should please forgive me. Anyway, I must have wronged you. I'm very, very sorry. I have been so stupid and foolish, even to my own blood. I am very sorry, Biko Monem, but I don't know. Biko, please, I'm sorry, please, I'm sorry, forgive me. Very sorry, please. Okay, forget. You make up on me, eh? It's a disease, eh? <laughs> okay. Hi. Um, I want to cook rice. Mm. So everybody should follow me. Yay! Mm. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> we have seen what happened to our family. We were deceived. Into believing that Rema was a bad woman. And we were acting based on that. Thank God we have found out the truth. Please, my children. Chica. Ebuka. Let's live together as one with one heart. Please, my children, forgive me. Forgive us for everything we did to you. Please. I beg you, be Gomo. Take me back as your mother. And I promise to be a good mother to you. Biko, come somewhere. Ah, uh, there is nothing to say again. You've said it all and said it to be so forever. Jade. Hello. Um, we've heard all you've said. 
and we pray that um, it will remain like that from today. Well, I want to use this opportunity to thank each and every one of us here who contributed to the successful burial of my mother. I'm highly indebted to all of you here. If I, you are one in a million. Jude, a guy from nowhere, yet you have a heart of gold. Ikenna, the bus conductor, I saw my sister crying inside the bus where every other person was not bothered. But he cares and kept telling my sister that all will be well and today all is well indeed. Yes, yes sir. one <coughs> You are a brother indeed. I am proud of you. Let us join hands and fight our enemies together. Uh, the former tigers of our family that just repented. <laughs> if you want, we are proud of you. And for our mother, mommy, you are great. We are proud of you. Let us live in peace and harmony so that the will of Izzy Chiku Kabi Amano Nigwe will be done in this family. Amen. 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 <coughs> well spoken, my brother. Nice one. Ebuka and Chidi, your papers are ready. Yay. <coughs> you guys will be traveling with us because there are lots of opportunities in the country we are based. Wow. <laughs> America! Here I come! What's up? Ebuka, calm down. We don't base America. Yeah, we base Mali. Yes. Wanda! Malaysia, Wanda! Here I come, Ebuka! And when we get to Malaysia, make sure you put your mind in the game. So that you make your people proud. I got Tiffany Mano! Yes, sir! Wherever you Thank you. God bless you. Oh my God! Hey! If I. You've done a lot. My brother. I. You've done a lot. My God. Yes, Amen. My God will keep blessing you. Amen. Amen. Thank you. Amen. You're welcome, my brother. And my God will keep on blessing you. Amen. God will bless all of you. Amen. Well, she comes soon. You are a strong woman. Right from the first day I met you, I've always known that you are a strong woman. The way you handled your mother's issue and every other thing, it was awesome. No. Let me make a proposal. Will you marry the conductor? This is not the right place to say something like this, and you know. So, because of that, I'm going to say... Hey. 
Yes. 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 Yes.